Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Triangle Strategy. Last time we left off, we finished Frederica's battle. And it uh, wasn't so bad. It's pretty easy, all things considered. Swayed by Frederica's words, the Roselle of the Source rise up to take their freedom from the clutches of their captors. Not long after, Byzantian forces encircle them, preventing their escape. But not all is lost. Jerome and the Rosellan villagers arrive just in time, throwing their foe into disarray and affording Frederica and the others a window to escape the capital. With the long-suffering sinners freed from their shackles and the holy symbol of their faith destroyed, the people of Hyzant are left shaken to their very core. Frederica and the others take advantage of the ensuing chaos to reunite with their allies. Meanwhile, Benedict succeeds in driving Exham Marshal from the Woolfort Domain, securing the safety of his home, hopefully, for the final time. Alright, sorry. I got a little bit scared about whether I did a sync test or not, so I had to go do that really quickly. While at the borders of Esfrost, Roland succeeds in procuring the Death Snell whose great blast will sound the end of Hyzant's reign over Norzelia. It's pretty fitting that Hyzant is like the big bad here at the end. Together with Frederica, they take their first step into their new future. Because, I mean, Gustadolf just fell like a sack of potatoes to one of my, like, one set of my units. But uh, Hyzant were actually having to storm with reinforcements, the Death Snell, and all of these things to just completely wipe out the leadership here. On the barren wasteland surrounding Hyzant, they gather, the goddess's shield towering before them. As Serenoa's plan reaches its climax. Alright, chapter 19, The Fortress That Is Faith. Uh, three character stories. Their duty's done, all regiments return to their promised meeting place. The final battle against Hyzant is nigh. Picoletta's story, Archibald's story. Okay, we got some new stories to go through, cool. Beneath a star-filled sky, Picoletta recalls her days in the circus. Yeah, and now you're a blood-soaked warrior that's spent their time on the battlefield. <laughs> stars are so pretty. They're always so bright, no matter where I go. You were in a circus, right, Picoletta? Yep. We performed in all kinds of places together. The people in the circus were from all over, too. There were people from Glenbrook, people from Hyzant. But when the war started, the circus broke up. Our circus master was from Esfrost, and he said he had to go and fight for his country. Even the poor animals were all taken away. They were like my family. Picoletta. But I won't give up. I'll help you end this war, and then I'll bring back my circus troupe. I believe in you, Picoletta. But to do that, you'll need to build up your strength. And look, it's almost time to eat. Yay! Let's eat together again today. Oh, P Gila acting like a mom to Picoletta, basically. Well, that was a short one. Wow. My convictions have been strengthened. Uh, the former saint has only one regret left in his heart. What do you regret, Archibald? I'm so glad you had a reaction to uh, uh, Camcell. That's so cool. Who in their right mind sends an old man on a scouting mission? Oh, goddess, take me. I can't wait to retire. Of course, I can't very well do so until the war is over. What will you do once it is? I can't say I have any plans in particular. But there is one regret I'd like to remedy. I'd like to find my first love. 
I still dream of her. Even all these years later. Huh. She was the general of the S. Frosty forces during the siege of the Citadel of the Sands. The turning point of the Salt Iron War, that was. I never learned her name. We were enemies, yes, but it was clear from the battle we waged how much we admired one another. She caught a beautiful figure on the battlefield. Her every movement was majestic. More than anything, she was a fearsome warrior. Truly, there is none in the world like her. I wonder what might have been had we met in a tavern instead of as enemies. I see. I hope you can find her then. As do I. As do I. Well, looky here. <laughs> Easy mark. Oh, you stupid, stupid idiots. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get them before they wise up. There. Huh. <laughs> he saw us? Well, we're too far away. Inhumanly possible. M monster! You're not that How far. How did you sense those bandits <laughs> from such a distance? like that will never get the better of me. Until this war is over, I've only begun to fight. I can see you mean that. Ah, that's it. I know what I'm going to do when we're done fighting. I'll travel the land till I find the S. Frosty General who caught my eye. It's strange, but I sense her presence wherever I go. Might be she's closer than I think. If that's the case, I'd better do what I can to end this war, and fast. Time to work twice as hard for an early retirement. <laughs> yep, all right, Archibald. You go find your lady friend. I, uh, don't know if I'm gonna use you anymore. Because it seems like, I, I guess we have more battles ahead of us. I wasn't sure if that was going to be the end or what, but uh, it does not seem like it was. So I'm not really sure who's my party is going to be. Medina goes to assist some nurses in dire need of aid, where another uh, critical choice is laid before her. Yeah, Medina's getting a lot of critical choices, but that's the reality of being uh, someone that works in uh, medical, I suppose. Thank you for journeying all this way to assist us, Medina. I fear the heels in this region are otherwise occupied today. Oh, wait, we've Perhaps. seen this one. We've seen this one. Apologies. Yeah, 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 okay. This, this is one we saw earlier, I just didn't get it this route? Because, yeah, this is the one where the one walks up. Yeah, an S. Frosty soldier, okay. Yeah, 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 so we've, we've seen that one. We just got it again, basically. Okay. Well, it's cool that we got to see a little bit more of Archibald's story and everything. Uh, my convictions have strengthened. Is my roster all back together? Oh my god, they are. Well, would you look at this crew? I mean, there's a few that I'm like, okay, I know I'll use those guys. But, uh, I'm not totally sure. Um, like, I know I'll use Frederica. I know I'll use Eridor. I'm pretty confident I'll use Milo and Huet. Um... A lot of other people, though, is kind of up in the air. Oh, of course, Medina. Uh, Izana, you stole, you sold me on your, on you a little bit more. I'm not super crazy in the Picoletta, Lionel, Yulio. Narv is always a good pick. Hasabara, I'm not into, unfortunately. Anna, Saranoa, Benedict are good. Rudolph's good. Yeah, I don't know. We'll have to, uh, we'll have to see. Do you have anything uh, interesting for me? You said someone's ready for a promotion. Cool. Um, who do I want to give their promotion? Because let's see. If I do this, you'll have the potential to learn some things. Also, increase your strength and accuracy. Benedict would be able to use. Let's see. Grant immunity to silence, fury, and temptation. That's pretty good. Um, 
Saranoa doesn't really need it. Uh, Roland would get Spring in your step, which is not awful. I don't remember liking Anna's thing. Narv would be pretty good because you get extending your reach and you get that beam ability. It would be kind of cool to advance you, but uh, I unfortunately can't get the stuff to upgrade you anymore, so uh, yep, that sucks. Right of luck. Don't know what that means. Lionel, yeah. I'm not sure who I'll give this promotion to, if I'm going to be honest. So like I said, Saranoa doesn't really need it. I don't really believe Roland does either. It has to go on someone I know I'm going to use. I mean, you're a pretty good candidate, Milo. Sure, Milo. Let's go ahead and make you a master dancer, why don't we? Now you have more TP and everything, too. Look how far I've come. Congratulations. Cool. Alright, uh, I'm pretty happy with that. Let's go ahead and see what we can do here at the trade post. Anything interesting? Yeah, nothing more that I can do. Marbles of Norzelia. Uh, 14 and 15. These might just be ones that I've read but hadn't gotten on this playthrough, though. Let me look at them at least. <clears throat> uh, 14 and 15. Happened uh, by, upon that village by mistake while lost in my travels. When I saw that everyone's hair was the color of roses, I realized they must be in the Roselin village. I had thought it uh, to be a mere rumor until then. At first they were wary of me, no doubt because I was an outsider, but when they learned that I had been wandering the wilderness for days and was moments from collapse, I was immediately welcomed into their midst to even prepare to... Brief spell... Yeah, 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 no, no, no. No, no, no. I, we, we've read that one before. I'm pretty sure, which probably means we've read 15 as well. I, Marco, began this journey to explore every corner of Norzelia. Unfortunately, that dream is yet unfulfilled. I trekked through forests, traversed deserts, sailed up rivers and scaled mountains, rode horses at times, and soared atop the backs of hawks at others, but even still, there were peaks beyond the mountains and a sea of sand as far as the eye can see. Norzelia is a land without end, and so my dream may end at that, a dream. Even if it does, I have no regrets. I learned so much about Norzelia in my travels. I've seen both its wilds and cities and met countless people who call this realm home. My journey was full of discoveries and inspiring moments. I wrote this diary to convey the incredible things I was blessed to witness with my own eyes and how those marvels made me feel. I believe that someday another traveler will pick up my journey where I left off. They will fulfill my dream of seeing every corner of Norzelia. I don't remember that one as much, but I definitely remember the one talking about the Roselin village. <clears throat> uh, Lionel's learned a new skill, Golden Opportunity. Its effects are sure to have the enemy's attention and for a practically negligible fee, leave everything to Lionel. Okay, yeah. So you're telling me about your new ability. Um, do you sell any new things? That's mostly what I want. Um, nope. I, you're still completely out of all that stuff. Okay, so... Basically, all I could buy here... Is, uh, some of this jazz. Buy some more of those. Some more ranged... Ooh, not that many. Um, some more ranged HP recovery pellets. There we go. And let's hit this up. Um, yeah, like, I'm gonna have to use Saranoa, so Saranoa is definitely an option for upgrading, as is Eridor. I'm pretty into Flanagan as well. I would like to try and use Flanagan. Um, I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see in the next battle who we decide to use. I still don't think I'm gonna do these. I'm just... Oh, wait, well, that one's new. The force who occupies the dais will be the victor. Many of your enemy tr troops can knock units back with their attacks, so careful positioning will be vital to seize the day. Uh, I mean, okay, I guess we can do this one. I'm just not interested in Field of Greed or Minecart tactics because, quite honestly, they're just kind of uh, boring since I've already done them before. But this could be a good opportunity to level up, so I have to occupy the area. And I get to choose eight units. Um, well, if that's the case, I should probably be careful with who I pick here. So you go, go. Um, Medina will be good. Eridor will be good. Frederica could be useful. 
Um, I'm also wanting to use characters that I actually want to level. Uh, Benedict... Rudolph has Staggering Arrow, which could be good. Do you have a knockback ability? Mm. Yeah, you, I don't have that ability on you that makes it so you can't be knocked back, otherwise you would be pretty useful here, Flanagan. Um, Milo, probably. Roland, you can knock back. Like I said, I want some people that can knock back. And... Let's do, like, Narv. So, you can knock back Roland, Eridor can knock back, Rudolph can knock back. And then we have a few other people to handle various other things. Alright, well, Eridor certainly needs to get up there. Um, mm, not you. Okay, Eridor should be in the front slot. Milo, you can actually stay up there. Uh, we'll put, yeah, all my healers and stuff down here, and then Sarah Noah can, uh, chill over here. Okay, that looks good to me. Let's view the stage's overview. Okay, so the side that occupies the area indicated by the yellow panels will win. If you're knocked off the stage, get back on it quickly. As long as one friendly unit remains within the area, it will not be occupied. Okay. So yeah, that's the struggle here. Flanagan would basically ensure a victory in this battle as long as he doesn't die. If he has that ability, but... Knockback has been such a non-factor so far in the game that it just wasn't the biggest deal for me. Okay, so... You're going to go first. Ow! Okay, I mean, they are very, very high level. And you are, like the main enemy, I suppose. So, yeah, that makes sense, I guess. Um... God, they got, like, spearmen and all kinds of crazy stuff. I really need to kill this idiot, though. You take, like, so little damage, though. But hey, we're getting big XP. Okay. Um... Let's, uh, moon jump... Over here, uh, tempt you, 64%, damn it all, evade detection, okay, just move back, I really tried, I tried, Where shall we strike? um, I can almost hit that dork, almost, not quite though, let's, uh, stay right there for now, Sarah Noah. Um, alright. Whose turns are coming up? Ooh, Eridor needs to be healed. Let's, uh, go ahead and drop a large HP here recovery go. pellet on you. I'm here to help. There we are. We doing this? Rudolph, I would love to get you in a better spot. Uh... Yeah, let's put a trap I'll right there. This. Just in case that idiot <laughs> runs up there. That would make it quite useful. Ooh. I'll show you what I God, these guys hurt. I guess this is the, you know, the issue with me not uh, really grinding uh, much or anything. Um, yeah, I need magic to help take out this doofus and these shield bears. Their physical defense is way too high for who I currently have up here. Hmm... This is, uh, problematic, I would say. Uh... Let's just put you right there, Narv. For right now. And I do have an idea about- Oh, that sucks. You got the paralysis and everything, and you walked the direction I didn't think you would, slash wasn't hoping you would. Um, King Shield, please. Guaranteed Fury. There we go. God, that's such a good ability. Uh, alright, so... Can I, like, light wave you up here? Thank you. I just really need to start murdering some people. It needs to happen. So, yeah, that looks good to me. There we are. Why are the Rosellans working with you? How rude. 
Stop it, Rosellans. Uh, okay, push back. Back three squares. That is a kill. Out of my way. There we are. For my kingdom. Good shit, Rollins. You can move back over here so that you don't die. For the greater good. Uh, Medina, go ahead and fast acting medication, what Frederica. And Frederica, peace. can you? Not quite. Okay, you're gonna have to move up a little bit. Um, but that's fine. You can drop another Scorch on those we idiots. Make our ideals reality. God, Frederica's so Forward. strong. Um... Alright. I do have enough for a missed opportunity here. I think I may use that on you. <clears throat> Just because you're very, very strong and annoying. So, let's pop that. Shall we dance? Uh, Milo... Not really a ton for you to do. You can get over here and green mist, which is magic damage, so that wouldn't be bad. Uh, steel TP. Let's let's green mist. There we are. We didn't get the poison, unfortunately, but that's fine. Okay, you're still furied. Boom. Alright, get in there, more magic damage. We can drop a spark on this idiot. Ready to see Zap. I'll make you proud, Grandfather. Good stuff. Good All right, now you, Rudolph. Um. Uh, you can't actually steal boat anyone. If I move right here, you can shoot this person. Forty-eight percent chance to sleep would be nice. There we go. Cool. That's somebody snoozing, so that's one less person to worry about. Okay, you're not stopped anymore. You me. Um, if only you had enough for uh, what's it called? Um, say I could do basically no damage to you, or an okay amount of damage to you. Uh, Frederica's turn is coming up, so I will be able to restore a little bit. Um, is there anybody you could push? Off, Roland. No, not really. Let's just, uh... Are your stats buffed? No. So let's go over here and use, uh... A, uh... Yeah. Yeah, let's... Here. Ah, shit, that Thanks. was the... Fuck. I, <laughs> I thought it was over, uh, Frederica. Whoops. I see right that I was my bad. But it's fine. I can just double item with you. And we can, uh, ranged HP recovery pellet. Here you go. And then, um, I can use a, uh, another one of those things. That was my bad. It, I, I could have sworn it was on Frederica. Here you go, Hugh. <laughs> there we go. Now Frederica, when her turn comes around, will be able to use a, uh, another spell. Okay, you're coming in to hit Eridor. Okay, so if I move right here, I can drop it on you. That'll be big damage on a lot of people. We might get really, really messed up here, but this guy's almost so dead. Nice. Ooh, that evasion though. 52% chance to hit. A little unfortunate. Um, unite. I mean, if it did actually hit, it would be pretty ideal. Oh my god, and I got the poison? Okay, so you're dead. Your next action. That's good. Evade detection. I need to actually check what that does. So I can see. Ooh. Okay, what, what does evade detection do? Allows you to slip past enemies and obstacles. Okay, that's really cool. That's a pretty unique one. Um, hello, Narv, uh, you could Icy Breath them or Scorch them. Icy Breath is better. Uh, yeah, I think, th I think that's good. The poison's gonna kill the boss, I'm pretty sure. I think that's happening. Let's move over here, because if we get knocked off, we're kind of boned. Um... 
Okay, could you kill? You could. 100% chance. Dead. Oh, I could have moved you into the, uh, spoil. That's my bad. Uh... Smack. Okay, I think we've got this under control here. Um... Can't knock anybody off. I could flash of steel all these dorks. That's pretty good damage. There we go. Whatever it takes. Yeah, this is probably a pretty good fight to do, in all honesty, just because, um... Uh... Ooh. Frederica doesn't really need any more XP, though. Um... Let's instead just, uh, fast-acting medication We're Narv. Narv could use the XP Life more. Frederica's awesome. just so high level already. We don't really need her being any higher level. God, these mages are just eating them up, man. Forward. Uh, okay, Saranoa, you get down there. We need to grab that spoil. Let's go then. And Rudolph, you can get this one that I should have gotten f with you earlier. Let me show you what I've learned. And yeah, I just I don't want to give you those kills, Frederica. If I'm going to be honest, just move over there and flame shield yourself. <clears throat> You're already so high level, you don't... Owie. Um, Milo could use a little bit of XP. Sure. What should I... Let's see, you don't have enough to tempt. Um, you could... Ooh. Mm, no. Oh wait, don't I get... Gain the use of one more command. Yeah, okay. So we can come over here, moon jump, jump to this, and hit this dork. Not enough to kill, really. Damn, they just barely live. Oh well. Some level ups for everyone. Okay, and you got killed. Um, Roland can get this spoil. Aerodor can get this spoil. And sprint. Push on through! That XP buff. For the greater good. There we go. And you guys landed down here, so you can grab that. Cool. Alright, now we can finish the fight. Not over <clears> yet. I'll yeah, that was a pretty good amount of XP I just got. Probably really, really worth doing, even if just to uh, level up a bit. You need to use something. Use an HP recovery pellet on yourself for the XP. Let's go then. There we are. Rudolph, you can just set down a trap. Trying something new. There we are. Uh, and I think we're good there. <laughs> Milo can get some more damage in. There we are. Cool. <clears throat> All right, that was a pretty easy battle. Um, the mage is just absolutely eating through that one character was quite useful. I do wish I had some silver so that I could um. Upgrade of Laura. That's kind of a bummer. There was... None of these gave, like, a silver, did they? Uh, it doesn't look like it. It's mostly just upgrade materials and stuff, yeah. Alright, well, we can upgrade some more people now. <clears throat> it is a bummer that I won't be able to use of Laura as much as I would like, but... Oh well. So, let's count out ten characters. So, I got Saranoa, I got Roland, if I decide to use him. We'll count out the ones I absolutely want to use. So, Saranoa, Frederica, Huet, Eridor, Milo, and, um, Narv. That's six. So, we have space for four more. Um... Let's see, four more... Benedict is pretty good. Roland's pretty good. Then maybe... I'm really into Flanagan, actually. And maybe Rudolph? It's it's between Rudolph or Anna. And Rudolph's the uh, higher rank. Right? Yeah, I mean, they're both pretty damn good. It's a hard choice. <clears throat> it's just about whether I want two archers or not. I already have two mages. So, we really just need to decide who to upgrade here. Uh, Saranoa, you... Yeah, I wish I had more superior iron. Decreasing the 
cost of double thrust could be good. Increasing Eridor's weapon potency could also be good. Uh, Flanagan, if I decide to use you... I don't know, I just really like the mobility and everything with you. Plus, Rampart could be incredibly useful in a pinch. Uh, Medina? Nothing. Yeah, let's, uh... Upgrade Flanagan, I think. Do I need two tanks? I'm not really sure that I do. But, I don't know. I just think Flanagan's neat. Okay? And that's really all the all the reason I need. Alright, cool. Let's, uh, leave the encampment now. And go do a battle. I'm not sure how much more of the game is left. Uh... Duty's done. All regiments return to their promised meeting place. The final battle against Hyzant is nigh. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure how many more battles we have uh, in the game. Uh, <clears throat> I, I I thought it was going to end after the other three, to be honest. But my friends, Roland, Frederica, Benedict, all of you who have gathered under our banner, we have weathered much to come this far. However, the battle of our lives is before us. The battle for our future. For the future of all Norzelia. Until we arrive at the other side of it, I ask that you remain steadfast by my side. You don't need to ask. We're here because we believe in the path you've shown us. And we won't quit it now. In weal and woe, we'll be with you until the end. I am of the same mind. Thank you, everyone. Then, before we approach the threshold of our destiny, let us review the strategy that will see us through it. The Triangle Strategy. Our final aim is to gain control of the Hierophant's Palace. Yet to even approach it, we must breach the Goddess's shield, which has never fallen in Norzelius history. History must give way to new thinking and new weapons. And today, my death now shall usher us into a new age. With the shield destroyed, the route to the capital should be cleared. There is but one obstacle. It will take time to position the cannon and ready it to fire. The enemy must be distracted to allow you to work free of harassment. And I believe I know upon whose shoulders that role lies. Indeed. House Wolfwork shall draw out Hyzant's main forces. We'll attack the shield's western side, hopefully enticing a good measure of Hyzant's soldiers in the process. While they're occupied, Lord Svarog and the Asfrosti soldiers will begin readying the cannon from the south. When they are done, the blast shall echo across the wasteland, and the shield shall fall. When we have won our victory in the west, we'll join with Svarog and bring our full strength to bear upon the capital. The Consortium shall keep your rear protected. That I promise. The plan is set! Lord Saranoa, my people wish to offer what support we can. Where would you have us? Yay, Jerome's gonna fight with us too. Thank you, Jerome. Those of you who can fight, harry Hyzant's forces in the northern and eastern parts of the capital. The city is still reeling from the Rosellen uprising. With luck, this shall be over quickly and with few losses to mourn. Indeed. Let's bring an end to this as quickly as we can. The people have seen enough suffering. I do find myself wondering if I could finish this today because uh, it would be very good for my schedule if I could. Um, it would free up a slot and I don't know, this seems like it might be the final battle, but there might be like a true final battle after this or something. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see how things go. And let us make ready. Each to their jobs. I'd be open to My it, is Lord, all I'm saying. Soldiers are always full of nerves before a battle. It would do well to speak with them. Make clear in their minds the victory you envision. Of course. I'll go to them. We shall see. If we can pull this off. Final battle is upon us. Before then, I would speak to everyone. Yeah, see, you're saying that's the, it's the final battle. Maybe this is it. I don't know. We'll see. 
a lot of times games will be like it's the final battle for it not to be the final battle so we'll, we'll see we'll see what happens uh, unfinished letter we escaped somehow there are not many of us but we were at least able to determine that bolt was indeed hidden inside bolt we took with us but a small fragment this is proof that our legends are true the key to the chains that bind so these are the Roselans that escaped initially with uh, Orlea there's still hope but we no, I have done all I can. While I was able to rally my brethren to bleh, I could not destroy bleh, our bleh, failed. We were forced to leave behind many, and still barely escaped with our lives. That is the harsh reality, the extent of my capabilities. Yeah. My heart breaks when I think of how powerless I am, but I will not give up hope. I must ensure that this key and the fight to free bleh, are passed on to future generations, so that someday... Someone will take up my mantle and finish what I have started, so that they will finally free our brethren from... Well, there's no time for tears. Every step forward matters, no matter how small. Because there's still hope. Yeah, this is this is just straight up Orlea. I feel like I should hand this to Frederica and be like, Hey, here. I found this on the ground in the one spot we decided to make camp. Here is that we able to cast off the shackles that bound them for so long. But our battle is not yet over. The Norzelia that we all dream of is within reach. We need only win this battle to grab hold of it. And then this battle will put an end to Hyzant's monopoly over salt. Just like the Salt Iron War of 30 years past, this fight will no doubt leave its own mark on history. When I think about it, the day we arrived in Glimbrook really was when all this began. But an honor to fight by your side, Lord Saranoa. Yeah, God, that feels like forever ago. Uh, $2,700 reduce. Allow me to take care of the logistical support. I will do everything in my power to see you succeed, for today's failure is not an option. Up against the holy state of Hyzant, I have heard that they fear no one but the goddess herself. Justice is on our side. We are with you until the end, Lord Saranoa. Went through a lot to get here, staring down the holy state's stronghold. Final battle's upon us, lad. Is the shield of the House of Wolfort. I swear I'll protect you to my last breath. Okay. The spitting image of Lord Simon, thinking ever of your people, striving for balance and forging a new path forward. Shan't lose focus, my lord. Victory will be ours. If any of the three regiments had failed, we wouldn't be where we are now. I feel like we can overcome anything, so long as we work together. Let us topple Hyzant and bring a bright new era to Norzelia. This is a very hype moment. Everybody's so excited and hyped and pumped and nervous, probably. I lost confidence in myself as king and worried about whether or not I could truly fulfill my duties. But by succeeding in bringing Lord Svalrog to our side, I was reminded of my role. You're quite the vassal, giving orders to his liege. <laughs> but I have no regrets in walking this path with you. Thank you, Saranoma. We will win this day, I promise you that. This frosty army will make for the southern side of the shield when we begin our diversion. Say the word and I will give them the signal. We will strike from the northern gate and lure the enemy away. The Rizal are with you every step of the way, my lord. Thank you. Love you, Jerome. Still wish you joined. 33,000? Or 3,300. I wish it was 32,000. Never thought we would be fighting Hyzan side by side with Esfrost. But to be honest, I don't think we could ask for better soldiers than the Black Irons. Damn right. Panacea pellet. Pretty useful. I saw the Death Snell with my own eyes. If anything can destroy the Goddess of Shield, it's that cannon. Here's hoping. Cure all pellets. Today we put an end to Hyzant's tyranny and see my son's dream of a new era realized at last. Damn right, Svalrog. Time has come to show the world what the Death Snell can do. Just give us the word and we will reduce the Goddess's Shield to rubble. The Nell is strong, but takes time to fire. Please buy us some time while we ready the cannon. I will do this. Okay, I'm just looking around. I don't see any more shinies. I don't think. Thought I saw something up there at the top. I think we got them all. It was mostly just money and healing items, which, quite frankly, is most of what I want. So, that is good. Just rub up against these a little bit more. All right, well, I do have some money to go spend. So how about we go spend that really quickly? Um, yep. So, Lionel. Boom. Uh, what do I need? I could buy some more of these. I got the money for it. Panacea pellets, poison recovery. 
cure-alls. Uh, I did mention wanting some invigorating spices. Let's, uh, get some of those. I don't want that- you know what, fuck it. Just buy that many. <laughs> Fortifying spices, sure. Warding spices, sure. Um... Decreases physical defense I would like more of. Alright, and any kind of bracelets I can buy, nothing really too crazy. I mean, I still have a lot of- a lot more money. Oh yeah, let's get some more of these so that, uh... Oh wait, do I have Medina at weapon rank 3? I don't, do I? Medina, I don't have you at weapon rank 3. I might need that ability. Can I upgrade you? You need a diamond. And I do, I do have the stuff I need. Can we just get a diamond really quickly from Archibald? Archibald, don't hold out on me. Please don't tell me I used a diamond on someone else. Oh my god, we're good. We're good. Okay. Oh man, that would have been spooky to not have access to that. Yens is the other person that needed it. Give me. Yes. That is such a good ability. I, I can't go into this final battle without it. Okay. Let's, uh, let's do. Let's do it. See how hard this is going to be. Like I said, I think I got everything, so let's end exploration. Morale is high and the soldiers are ready for battle. It's time to put our convictions to the test for all Norzelia. Ooh, okay. I'm still wondering if this is actually the final battle. The Wolfort soldiers march toward the west of the goddess's shield, ready to risk life and limb making a show of attacking the nigh impregnable barrier. Cause yeah, this can't because we're just this is just us getting inside. We're still gonna have to like fight the Hierophant and Edor and stuff, right? Their display is enough to spur Exham to action, as he senses an opportunity to erase the sting of his recent defeat. He musters what troops remain in Hyzant, and sets forth to meet his former ally in the field. He should be dead. Couldn't you, could you just like, you know, actually kill Exham and then be like, Oh, he was replaced by his twin brother, Exham. And then, yeah, have me fight him instead? <laughs> <laughs> it just pisses me off that XRM is still alive for this. The two armies face each other, tension thick in the air. While to the south, Svarog and his men work hurriedly to prepare the cannon for its grand debut. All right, let's go. If I had to guess, there's probably like two fights. This one and the next one, the final one. My countrymen, the rebel Wolfords have spat in the face of our generosity and defied the goddess and her mercy. It would also be weird if Exham, of all people, was the final boss, basically. Now, scouts report that they have returned. They have been sighted in the west, doubtless hoping to catch us in a moment of confusion. However, before them stands the goddess's shield, silent and unyielding. It would be easy for us to leave them there to rot in the harsh sun. But that is more generous than they deserve. Those fiends who cast a wicked spell over the Roselle and destroyed the symbol of our goddess's beneficence. The Wolferts were behind that? Their sins are too great. They must be punished. Yes, in her name we must smite them as is the fate of all heretics. If they will not bow their heads in obedience, then we shall leave them piled in the dust. They may have destroyed the statue. Whoop, didn't mean to press that. of the goddess, but her blessing is eternal. Her smile is at our backs. Let us crush these infidels in her name. May the will of the goddess be our sword, and may her judgment strike true. In the name of the goddess, in the name of the goddess! Hmm. I still have my talent for rousing rabble. It is time to wash away the disgrace of my defeat. God. I can't believe you wore your flame immune undies that day. Alright. Let's go. Recommended level is 31. 
That's lower than the level for the thing that I did. As Esferos prepares the death knell, Sereno advances his troops to the western side of the Goddess of Shield to distract Hyzant. But who is leading their charge? Let's find out. I like that we still that we see the consortium listed. Um, oh no, that's not the consortium. That's just Wolfort banner. I saw like scales, which makes me think of trading, but that's our scales. Very open. Good. We're to meet them in the field then. I much prefer that over a protracted siege. We mustn't take Exham lightly. If we're to distract his forces, we must make him believe we mean this to be our last stand. We've succeeded so far. He comes. Wolford Kurz, prepare to receive the goddess's punishment. She has blessed me, Exham Marshal, with the permission to carry out her will. Minister Exham, all I did, I did for the people of Norzelia. <clears throat> to free them from the yoke of Hyzant's injustice. I know you harbor your own doubts about your country's rule, so I will ask you this once, and once only. Join us. Lay down your arms and help us build a new Norzelia. A greater Norzelia. I always knew you were destined for greatness, Saranoa. I admit I take great interest in seeing this future you will build. Then let us combine forces. I refuse. Why? Tis a simple reason. House Wolfort inflicted the only blemish on my perfect record. Wow, what a what an arrogant bastard. So, I must prove to the world that this was merely a quirk of fate. That I am, and have always been, your better. You would deny me just to assuage your own pride? You walked into a trap, you dumb idiot. If you do not understand, you deserve no further explanation. Come, Saranoa Wolfort. From now, we speak only with our blades. Everyone to formation. Exham has made his decision. We fight! Crush these heretics under your heels. That's a lot of spearmen. I mean, they have a lot of horse units too. Which makes me think, should I use Maxwell? But Maxwell's like, totally unupgraded. But that's a lot of spearmen. Like... Okay, I can deploy 10 units. Roland would get eaten up. If this was Fire Emblem, I would be incredibly intimidated by your sword, because it looks like a leaven sword. Um, yep, you are... You do take increased damage from spears. Here's their strength. Physical damage from an enemy and lower their strength in physical defense. And chance to tempt all enemies within range for two turns. That is horrifying. And I do not enjoy that. Um, you don't have a lot of units, if I'm going to be honest. Alright, who'll be rocking? Gila, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm gonna have to ask you to get out of here. Um... Benedict, possibly, as well. Roland is recommended. Sarah Noah's my lowest leveled unit. Um, honestly, archers don't seem like they'd be super useful here. I don't like the idea of having Rudolph. Uh, Milo will be good. Eridor will be good. Frederica will be good. Narv will likely be pretty useful as well. Um, I, th I think I might drop Benedict as well. Okay, if Laura's recommended, I know why you're recommended, but unfortunately, I I don't I, I like don't have you upgraded at all. You're pretty low level, all things considered. Huet, get in here, Huet. You're you're very 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 useful. Um, Anna, Maxwell. Yeah, it's hard. Flanagan? Flanagan could be useful. Do they have any archers? They have one archer. Maybe Flanagan? I'll, I'll consider a Flanagan. Um, Anna could maybe be useful. I'm kind of feeling Maxwell, though. Just because there's so many units that are weak to spears. There's so many. 
And it doesn't really matter who I use now, because, like, most of my units are pretty well upgraded, so... I don't have to focus on just the ones that I've upgraded a shit ton. Most of them are pretty, pretty well off, except, like, Evlora. <laughs> Sorry, Evlora. Um... Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with, uh, Maxwell. Bring victory. Um, I don't think I have the most, uh... You know, upgrades and stuff on him. Uh... Can't I go to the encampment? Isn't that an option somewhere? Select units to deploy. I thought you could go to the encampment here. Am I, am I just misremembering how to do it? I think I am. Uh, toggle that. Hmm. There we go. There it is. I had to press B to get out of that menu. Okay, back to the encampment really quickly. I just want to see um, my accessories and everything and see what I can put on people. So, uh, Maxwell has movement bangle and speed bangle. And what are your upgrades and everything looking like, friend? So, Maxi, what, what do you got? Okay, you have high jump, you have the damage upgrades that you need. Yeah, you're pretty well off, in all honesty. The only thing is you can't use high jump because uh, I would have needed to upgrade you before you could use it. I, I'll likely still use you though. So let's check out what accessories I can move onto some of my uh, main party here. So Narv, what do you got? You got a magic amulet, magic bracelet, you're good. Frederica, you're good. Although I would like to give you something better than a magic ring. Do I have like a... No, I don't have like a... Uh, yeah... Okay. Uh, Roland, you have the Jade Thumb Ring and a Speed Bracelet. I don't think I'm gonna keep that Jade Thumb Ring on you. Uh, what could I give you instead? You have HP Rings. A Strength Ring is being held by Yulio. Strength Amulet is held by Flanagan? Um, I'll take that off of Flanagan. Okay, and Speed Bracelet is pretty good, so we'll keep that. Uh, you have the Lightning Amulet, which will probably be useful because they likely have mages here. You have uh, All In on Evasion, absolutely fine. Magic Amulet, Magic Bracelet, you have nothing. HP Rings, didn't I get an HP... Um, yes, I have two HP bracelets. Okay, Medina, and, uh, probably the other one on Medina as well, if I'm going to be honest. Uh, yeah. Immunity to poison, okay. You have strength ring, wind amulet, you have strength bracelet, and vanguard scarf. Guarantees, that's not useful enough, I feel. We can swap that out for something better. Um, accuracy? Well, you don't really need the accuracy because you have, uh, that other stuff. Evasion, movement bangle, critical necklace. Critical necklace. Um, Sarah Noah, you have the resurrection earring and the grounding amulet. I'm going to take off the grounding amulet because, uh, boy, there's probably some better stuff I can give you. Um... Luck, uh, HP bracelet, strength bracelet, magic bracelet, a defense bracelet on Hasabara, sure, we can give you that. Um, and then who else am I using? Is that my full team? That is not my full team. Maxwell. Okay, Maxwell, yeah, you have the movement bangle. You have traverse now, so I don't super feel like you need that. I just want to give you something that possibly increases your strength a little bit more. You have the speed amulet right now. Uh, black anklet, amulet of immunity, resurrection earring. Yeah. Critical necklace, speed bracelet, accuracy bracelet. You're already pretty accurate. Defense bracelet's already on you, strength bracelet's on you. Yeah. You have the Strength Amulet. I mean, the best I could give you is a Strength Ring, which raises your strength by a whopping one. So... Eh. 
I'm just not crazy about a lot of the things on offer here for you. Sure, take the accuracy, I guess. Makes you immune to blind. What's the what's the uh, bracelet that gets rid of... Uh, makes me immune to temptation? The evasion bracelet. Okay, so Milo is immune to being uh, tempted, and so is uh, Flanagan. Okay, uh, let's get in here. This might be a very long video now, but I don't know. I wanted to do this fight, but I also felt like I had to do that other fight. So let's make sure everything's correct. Yep, all of my correct characters are in here. Um, there's Eridor. Flanagan is right here. Huet looking good. All right, squad. Let's do it. Here's hoping we can pull it off. I have high hopes for this crew. Very, very high hopes. I hope they don't disappoint me. Time to pierce the shield. Battle begins. Sarah Noah Wolfort, when the day is done, you shall know who between us deserves to be. I was wrong about you, Exham. The justice you espouse has ever been but a means to fulfill your own pride and ambition. How disappointing. Well then, let us see where your ambition takes you. Forward! Look at this squad of badasses. I love them. Uh, alright, so what do we want to do first? Um, there's not really a lot I could do that would be useful. Um, I, I mean, I, I just want them to come to me. Whoop. Uh, I think I accidentally pressed R there. I refuse to cower behind the goddess's shield. Once I strike down House Wolfort, I shall be the one to bring Norselia into a new era. Shall we begin? I shan't All right. Back. We, we shan't begin because you're just going to stand there. <laughs> uh, now what to do? Yep. We're, we're just going to wait the for on. them to do something. Oh my god. Did he just get like two turns in a row? What was that? Uh, Yeah, you have access to Shooting Star now, Hewitt. Might try that just to see what Forward. it looks like. Warming up. Yep. Hold men and women. Hold. Let's move you back here. Wait for them to move. Uh-huh. Titan defenses, physical defense increased. That's a good area on. for Narv to get into. So that's useful. Um, go ahead and get right there, Eridor. Narv, I'm going to ask that you get up there and hit these doofuses with uh, some of that. Boom. Magic defense is lowered. The archer's moving up. This isn't a good map for archers. That's why I only chose Huette, because she, yeah, she's an archer, but she's also incredibly mobile and has that really, really good ability um, of hers. Uh, I could Scorch you or Blazing Chains you. What's Blazing Chains you? Ooh, that'll create fires right there, which will make it even harder for them to get over here to me. Oh. Well, little Scorch would have, not, not Blazing Chains. My bad. Flanagan. Um, could you Aerial Assault? Nope, it wouldn't kill. You could Aerial Assault in, but yeah, it would not actually kill the doofus. Um, we'll Aerial Assault in just to do uh, a wee bit of damage and get you in position for them to hopefully focus on you. Oh my god, that's a scary ability. That is a horrifyingly scary ability. Um, yeah, this just isn't the fight for you, Maxwell. Your your fight is with the the stupid um, what you call them? Uh, the horseman. Jeez, I got there eventually. Uh, yeah, no, just 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 hold hold back. Stay right here. Um, I won't lose. Now, ooh, if only I could have gotten a Narv spot, we would have been able to uh, merc some people there. Um, not quite enough to kill. Close, but no cigar. Uh, I think I'm going to save your TP, Roland. 
throw in some more of these dorks get up here <laughs> now what to do? um milo how far can you jump you could jump right up to this doofus Think you can catch me? and hit them with a heart stealer 72 percent there we go yeah love you milo fantastic uh sarah noah get up in front of here Ooh, wait this is a really good opportunity actually uh under convictions banner on Tonight, so many people there we are lead. I must grow. big I'll xp medina um what i want you to do actually i believe um eh, actually i don't know Let's, uh... Yeah, no, let's do it. Let's fast-acting medication, Narv. I'll show you what I can do. Let's, uh... S Icy Breath, you two? Well, that's my charmed unit. I think I just want to move up so I can spark this one in the back. Lightning! There we are. This battle is ours. Huet. Um... Shooting Star... So wait, do I do I get moved to that location? Oh my god, no, this ability is amazing. I thought it was so high up and fluid isn't physical damage to a single enemy from above. I thought this was gonna be like a dive bomb attack, kinda what how like Flanagan does. Oh my god, it's not that at all. It's something much cooler. Lend me your wings, okay, I did not respect. Holy shit. Okay. Minister Exhab, reinforcements from the North Gate have arrived! means to steal my glory. Very well. Fall into rank. I do not get in my way. I don't know. Things aren't going super hot for you right now. Gonna be honest. Ooh, look at that big lineup of horsemen. Prep for murder. Okay. Um. Let's see. I could get you in there, Eridor. I don't super think we need to, though. Can I provoke the archer? Let's do that. There we go. Shall we begin? Are you coming in, XM? Nope. You're still gonna sit back there like a baby? Okay. Okay, you're not tempted anymore. Um. Okay, Frederica. I think a good scorch right here will do us just fine. There we go. Okay, you're bringing more units in, but you're gonna need more reinforcements than that, buddy. Uh, let's see, I could aerial assault in, or I could walk up and shield bash this doofus. Hit me. Oh, I missed it. Yeah, I like having two tanks, so I don't just have to put everyone behind, uh, Eridor. Um, Lance Hurl, run through. I'll Lance Hurl at you. Yes. Okay, yeah, level up, Maxwell. We need you leveled. Appropriately. Titan defenses. Alright, Roland. Uh, oh, if only I could get you right here. And then, well, I could. I don't think it's worth it, though. That's too ballsy of a move for not a lot of payoff. Um, double thrust on you. There we go. Shall we begin? Are you coming? Shall nope, you're just gonna sit back there like an idiot some more. Okay, cool. Don't see me complaining. Uh, you could tempt someone else. Uh, heart steal this dork. Delectable. There we go. Mm. <laughs> For the greater good. Okay. Um, I do need to restore some TP to people. Um, let's see here. What do I want to do? I would love the fast acting medication Narv actually, because Narv could drop some more ice on those dorks before they move. They're in kind of a perfect position to just get absolutely Potter. messed up. Oh yeah, look at that, beautiful. Don't be afraid. Bop. And you can move back. Okay, they're I'll going to be right moving in. Uh, you can die. I could move right here and even guarantee the death. Leave it to um, me. Okay, you're to down. Lead. I must grow. Yeah, this is a fantastic battlefield for me. Yeah, and you're just gonna heal them up because I knew you were because you're a stupid, stupid Here bastard, and I hate you. Um, all right. Uh, that person is no longer 
tempted. I could hit you. Or I could hit you. Or I could sight set and hit potentially like all of them. Hmm. Only a 70% chance to actually hit with Roland. Um. Whereas if I did this, I could hit potentially all of them. Yeah, let's sight set. All right, you're gonna run in. That's gonna get some damage. Good. I will fight to my last breath. Okay. Ooh, Maxwell's getting messed up. Owie. That spear attack that they have is frustrating to deal with. Come at me. Um. Okay, Exam is still back there. I am completely fine with just backing up and dealing with these problems. Uh, yeah. I'll be your shield. There we go. Two Furies. Realize the gulf between our skills. Charge. What gulf? You're standing back there like an idiot, acting like you're doing something. Um, boom. Big Dimaggio. <laughs> that was amazing. Allow me. Uh, okay. Frederica. Let's see. You could get over here and kill these two doofuses. Or you could Blazing Chains the Mage. Or, or the Bowman, sorry. Let's see. I might be able to just finish you guys off with someone else. I don't know. Let's take these two confirmed kills. Ooh, more units. Reinforcements from the South Gate are here, Minister Exam. God damn, you guys got too many gates. <laughs> As if I require Sarah Noah is mine. You are free to kill the rest of the rat. My courage will not waver. Um, okay, so they don't have a lot of people going anytime soon. It's mostly just a bunch of their units back there. Um I'm probably gonna drop uh, I'm gonna need the heal coming up. For sure. I'm definitely, definitely gonna need some heals. I stand ready. Um Flanagan. Uh let's see, what could you do? Let's uh do that. Fortify but lower your movement. That's fine. And we're gonna try to get you back over here towards the rest of the fight. Um Large ranged HP recovery pellet. Looks good to me. Gotta keep Maxwell alive. Yeah, this is gonna be a lot of units, but um my mages are eating them up. Uh if I just move up one, I can heart stealer you. This would unfortunately put me in range for a lot of attacks, but there we go. Oh behave. Austin Powers over here. Today marks the end of the Wolford name. Kneel before me. I hope you're watching. Uh, that didn't work. Get wrecked, nerd. Um. Okay, so Narv, you just need to stand over here. I love this. I love that the that the main theme is playing. You love to hear it. Oh God. Uh, he went in a bad spot. She's going soon. Okay, those people aren't going anytime soon. Uh, Hawk dive. Dive? Uh, yeah, we can hawk dive. Death from above. Boom. I want to take out this stupid ranger. Go kill some people. Yeah, there we go. Good, and now heal them. Uh, let's blind you. Pretty good chance. There we go. Get out of there. Um... Good. Boom. Okay, they're about to kill their own unit. Good shit. Love to see it. All because your unit was horny. That was their fault. Um. Boom. Good stuff. Oh, we are mopping the floor with these idiots. Uh-huh. That's a death. I like the squad. I like the squad. I've been waiting for this. Uh... It's time, Eridor. Wait, how much do you have? Shit, no, you don't have enough for it. I'm glad I didn't do that. I wanted to King Shield. I was just gonna send him in and King Shield. But, uh, no, that would have been bad. Um, zero percent chance to Fury you. Um, 
Let's see. Are your stats boosted? No. They have no mages. Eridor is incredibly resilient. So... I feel like... Hmm. Not very many of my units are in range. I feel like the better thing to do would just be to sit here and use, like, a tank spice. Um, yeah, fortifying on yourself. They have no mages. The only one who can do magic damage is possibly Exam with that one ability. Um, so I'm not super worried. Let's, uh, move back here. Refortify our position. Ooh, I should have flame shielded, uh, Eridor. Yeah, that'd have been a good call. Um, gonna double item here. I need to large HP recovery pellet you, you and ranged HP recovery pellet you. you. Medina, you're so busted. Shall we begin? Ooh, okay. Um, you're going soon. The only person that could hit you is the person that's blinded, so I don't think you're actually in any danger. Um, let's see here. I could shielding stance. We could jump in here. On you. The only thing I'm worried about Flanagan is you're kind of low HP. You do have ridiculous defense right now, though. Um, I could make you miss your next uh, turn. You don't have any uh, things, though. There's not a lot of point in doing that. I could just restore Flanagan. Um, let's uh, aerial assault in here, I think. You will be able to be attacked by four different people. Um, that is kind of scary. I feel like they're gonna mostly go for, um... I've mastered something new. Safe Haven. I don't know what that is. I feel like they're mostly gonna be moving towards, like, Milo and some of them may even attack Eridor. Ooh, yeah, that follow-up is nasty. Uh... Icy Breath? On both of you is not bad. Uh, could spark you instead, though, but eh. I'll just Icy Breath. That does damage to X-Ham, too. Um, Milo? You don't have a physical counter, right? No. Um, and we have a 40% chance to poison you. Uh, or, instead of that, I can Blue Knight. You don't have a TP to steal, but it could lower your strength and magic attack. Let's just hit you with this. You were kind to me before, but I sense that's come to an end. This is our final day in each other's company, isn't it? It is, my lord. I promise to deliver you gently to your fate. Take this! Oh. Were you to an item at one point? Is that what that was hinting at? Or were you just talking about, you know, your relationship is being on the same side and all that? For the honor of House okay, detection. Um... Boy, yeah, I sure would love to get in here and do some things with Sarah Noah, but... It feels extremely dangerous to do so. That is so many people that could potentially get a hit in on Sarah Noah right here. Um... It would be good damage, though. 84% chance to hit. Just go over here and grab the spoil instead. Yeah. Okay, you're coming in for a shot. Ooh, big, big tank though, big tanky. Mucho, mucho tanky. Um. Okay, you. What is your current attack range with Serpent Slayer? Okay, you have pretty damn good range. Um. Just sight set from right here. You can see a lot of people. Okay, you don't have enough to heal. Not an overly difficult battle, I will say. Pretty manageable. Um, oh, you don't have enough. No, Roland. You have enough to do that, though. Sure. There we go, big damage. No, I won't suffer the shame of defeat again. Thank you for leaving the safety of the shield, Exham. Sieges are so terribly boring. Only a glorious victory can erase an inglorious defeat. When the day is done, none alive shall doubt my prowess, and your petty rebellion shall be eclipsed by the story of my greatness. 
We've met many like you on our journey. Animals in the guises of men. They all reveal their true nature at the end of my spear. That's such a cool fucking line. <laughs> you tell him, Roland. Prepare to face the Oh Dawn's boy, spear. that's a cool line. Uh, all right. Um, traverse. I could traverse in. We do get another action if I do so, and then I could triple thrust someone. Oh man, this battle's about to get heated. Um. Let's move you just right here. Just lance roll. Um, ooh, that'll do a lot of damage. 100% chance to hit too. Well. Hell yeah. How annoying. <gasps> Whoop. That, that's, no that hurts, choice. but uh, that's fine. We got this. God, Flanagan is so tanky. Okay, we have enough. We have enough. Um, let's see. King Shield. If I do it from right there, I can get both of you. Or if I go over here, I can get like... So many people. Yeah, we'll we'll go over here. Get like all of these dorks. You'll have to get through me. God, that ability's so good, good, man. Um, I want to see if you have an interaction. I should really probably be focusing on healing right now. I realize this, but I I want to see if possibly. Um, you have an interaction. Uh. Let's, mm. Okay, no, I can't even double item. Uh, wait here, how about, how about we just uh, do this? I think this will still count. Um, do that. Try this. Nope, nothing, I okay. fight for peace. Um, well, that is a uh, big death. Bang, good stuff. Move back slightly, Frederica. Who needs my shield? Uh, safe haven? Oh my god, no way. Is that what safe haven is? Huh. Oh my god, you just have Aerodor's ability, or, or item as a passive. Oh, that is so good. Oh, that is so amazing. Um. Uh, ooh, Flanagan. I would love to get you in there and taunt that healer. But, um. I don't think that's in the cards, buddy. We can smack the stork, yeah. but I think I'm gonna ma uh, back over here after that. Yeah. I think we've got this victory in the bag, the though. Of House Ooh, big damage. Big damage. Could do slightly more with uh, Hawk Strike, but let's go with the Lang. There is no quarter between us, Saranoa. When the cries of the wounded and dying cease, it shall be I who is stand. I don't think so. You fall here, and with you, the last Emperor of Hyzant's pride shall fade. I don't know, Edor's still hanging out in there, and Lila. And the world shall be better for it. I'll make this quick. <laughs> Boom. Uh -huh. Get him. Must go on. Uh, yeah, Milo, you're not doing hot. Um, move back here and just heal yourself, quite frankly. Yeah. Now. There we go. Somebody wants to walk all the way back there to get you. Fine, they can hit you. Nice try. Here I come. Big air door damage. Um. Nar. Ho. Ho. The big damage. Don't be afraid. Oh. God. You love to see it. Oh, you're 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 gonna be boned, friend. Um. Could hit you. Could hit you. Could hit you. You're almost dead. Or... Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Well met. Brute. Curse you, Wolfort. Die, you stupid bastard. You should have died earlier. My glory. Unfortunately, you didn't have your anti-stabbing underwear on this time. Bam. All right. One bastard down. A few more to go. We're not done yet. Um, flash of steel. Uh, not gonna kill. I was really hoping it would. Um, hmm. If I do it from this end... Okay, I will get one kill at least if I do it from this end. 
Uh, yeah, let's do that. Boom. God, Flash of Steel is so damn good. I still fight. Um, yeah, not a lot for you to do, Maxwell. Just back up a little bit. You're a little uh, worse for wear here. I'm, I'm, I'm resisting my urge to be hyper aggressive here. I am not going to lie because I am, I'm so in it. Yeah, you better run. Come at me. I'm coming for your ass. I'm coming for all of you. <laughs> so you better run while you can. Boom. I fight for peace. Because you guys are super complicit. I I heard what you were saying with X Ham. You were like, oh, they're how how dare they do that to the goddess? You're not just you're not just innocent soldiers being forced to fight. Some of you may be, but I saw those people over there. With the Boom. Powers in me. My time has come. So no mercy. Um Let's see. Ooh, if only I could Oh, just a little bit closer, you little shit. Um Out of Do that. Flanagan's crazy tanky. We are good. Go ahead, stab him in the back. Who cares? Not You're not gonna kill him. And I can do one of these. Taste my shield! Let's play. God, he's so tanky. Gods. I'm so happy I decided to use him. Um This could you be a kill. Catch me. Uh green mist. It Let's is indeed. Bye bye. Oh god, just look at them fall! Like paper man! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's good to me. Do it. Um. Yeah, I mean that's your only shot, really. Oh. Juicy crit. Mmm. Delicious. Mwah. Ooh, chef's kiss for that. Mwah. Beautiful. Uh. Okay. What do we got? What else we got? Um. Uh. Ooh. I was hoping I could get over to the other side and help Roland out. With those dorks. Um, I could still traverse uh, right here and kill this dork. Uh, you just barely don't die. That way you'll die. That's fine. What are you guys gonna do, huh? Ooh, you hit me in the back. I'm terrified, really. Um, let's see, what do I want to drop here? Honestly, we don't even need to drop a bunch. Here you, here you go, Roland. Have a baby HP pellet. You don't really need that much healing because, uh... Um, Xam did such a shit job at killing us. Um, okay, there's only three units left. Uh, I still have Restore, so don't think I've forgotten. Boom. And, uh... Let's see, what do we want to do? Um, can't really do that much damage to you. I could provoke all of you, though. There we are. The only one I didn't get is the one I didn't care about. Cool. I won't lose. Uh huh. Flash of steel. This is where you fall. Bang. Dead. Got the crit even. Oh my God! They're just falling like flies. Oh boy. I got the spoils and jump to the other space so I can get this. Ooh, but there's golden spoils over there. Hold on. Forward. We're gonna delay your death a little bit because I want this shiny. Okay. Choices, choices. Who gets the final hit? Who gets the final hit? Milo, this is a pretty good battle for you. But... Hmm, who do I, who you do I want I to do. have it? It would be funny to give it to Medina. Um, I can't reach you with anybody else right now. Land again, I don't think you could get it. You don't do enough damage. Um, yeah. Okay, this this guy's probably gonna get one more turn. The hunt is on. Hmm. Yeah, you can't hit. Uh, unfortunately. Okay. For the greater you know, dark. no. We'll we'll give it to Frederica. No! Oh, I have a fantastic idea. Frederica, kill the last Tyzantian soldier in this battle with the chains that they put on your people. Stay right there. Mm. Yeah. Ooh, it feels good. <laughs> okay. 
Whew, that was, uh, pretty easy. That was, that was not bad. Exham who? What great hero. All I hear is a no-name that died twice. More reinforcements. Where the hell is that cannon? You don't think Esfrost has turned cloak again? No. If Hyzant isn't laid low today, then Esfrost's future is as bleak as ours. We win or we die. Together. Benedict's right. Swarog is an honorable man. He is not his nephew. They fight for the same future we do, and it will come soon, I promise. One final push. We're gonna go to the Svalrog point of view now. Oh, look at that thing. Oh, that's a big one. My lord, the cannon is in position and primed. God, I love how much they have to- they have to have to hold it steady. They have, like, it staked to the ground, they have a thing on the back that will, like, kind of hold it into position. This thing is a monstrosity. Good. Make ready to fire! May her maiden cry ring sweet in the wall for its ears. Align the sights! The target, the goddess's shield! Yes, my lord! Shield in sight! Fire! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Can we see the shield getting destroyed, please? That would be dope. Mmm. That's a big hole. A peal of cannon fire washes over the sandy wastes, and is answered by the crumple of steel and stone. The goddess's shield, once thought impregnable, is reduced to rubble. And behind it, Hyzant lies exposed like a seed in a cracked nut. I hope there wasn't anybody near that gate. Like, you know, innocence. And we are going to be cracking that nut. Sarah Extra hard. Nella cuts through the Hyzantian reinforcements, joining forces with Sparag and the Esfrosti. Together, they march through the breached wall. That's what you get for cowering behind with it. Every lie of their shattered faith laid bare before them. The Holy State's believers offer no resistance. Their restlessness and their fear slowly transforms into rage and anger at the Hierophant who has seemingly abandoned them in their time of need. With the goddess's teachings in shambles, the sun slowly sets on the holy state. Hmm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That feels good. Hey, you old bastard. Minister Edor, we are beaten and disgraced. How will you answer for this? What is there to answer for? God, it's I I gotta I gotta appreciate how many of them are missing. We killed Tenebris, we killed Exham, we killed Camcell, we killed uh well we didn't kill Sorceslave, but they did. God, it's just, all, all so many of them are missing, and it's just so nice to see. Don't act as if you're deaf to the world. The Roselle have rebelled. Esfrost and Glenbrook fight side by side. And you had, like, years to give this shit up, Lila. So, you're stuck here. So whatever happens, happens now. You're in it. The shield has been reduced to rubble. And our enemies overrun the streets. And that isn't the worst of it. The church's lies have been laid bare. The faithful are lost and demand answers. We cannot simply ignore them. 
Lila, my foolish girl. There is no need to worry. Hyzant shall triumph. Am I actually gonna attack and dethrone God? Are you gonna summon God on me? The goddess's blessing, her true blessing, must be made known. This is what we have labored for for so long. It shall gird the faithful and shame the wicked. You speak of the Hierophant? I do indeed. <laughs> The fortress that the fortress the fortress that is faith completed. Oh boy. Alright. I'm gonna be honest. Um I don't know how much more is left. Possibly one more fight. We're in it to win it. We're in it to win it. I'm gonna go grab some water, take care of a few things. We're in it for the long haul. This might be a three hour video or a four hour video, but I don't care. I'm too hyped. Alright. Let's get back in here. I'm H2O'd up. I'm ready to go. The goddess's shield shattered. The leaderless Hyzantian forces have no means of stopping Saranoa's march into the holy state. The unified army splits into two. Svarog's forces stay to gain control over the city. Meanwhile, Saranoa's forces surround the palace. They demand the unconditional surrender of both the Holy One and the two saints left inside. Chapter 20, no turning back. Let's do it. Battle start immediately. No fanfare, no cutscene, we're in it. Uh, without, while out training, Hubert recalls a promise she made to Roland before the war began. Okay, so this is the same one we've already seen before as well. <clears throat> I'll just skip it. Conviction, man. Gotta have all the convictions we can possibly get to, uh, kill God. Uh. Oh, okay, yeah, there's a, there's another cutscene. Whoopsie, I forgot there's two. I skipped the first one, there's a second one. All right, we get it, we get it. Cutscene, cutscene, cutscene. I shouldn't have even started it. But all right. That was the um, Roland Huet shipping cutscene, if I remember correctly. All right, let's go. Let's uh, go back to the encampment really quickly. Check out our units. Is there anyone I wanna, there's, there's people I can upgrade. Um, promote class. So, do I promote Maxwell? Do I promote Maxwell so he can use his high jump? He was pretty useful in that fight, if I'm going to be fair. Um, but I might want to use, like, Rudolph or something instead. Let's go see who I can upgrade. <clears throat> Over here first. Because this could very well be the final battle. Um, I could actually upgrade you if I get... Your thing. You need Eternal Resin. I think I used that already, unfortunately. Um, yeah, I think I might have used that already. Uh, Medina, you're good. You're good. I would need way more fiber to get your crazy ability. Um, Huet, I could give you not anything that I care about. Frederica, you're looking good. Benedict, I am not sure if I'm going to use you or not. Okay, so yeah, we got options on who to upgrade here. <clears throat> if this is going to be an indoor battle, I think I'm more interested in um, actually using Rol or Rudolph for this one. It just seems like it'd be a good call. So maybe I will try and upgrade uh, Rudolph because I would be able to get his extra damage increase there. I just have to see if I can get the Eternal Resin. I might have gotten the only one and used it to uh, buff someone else. I did. I did. Okay, no Eternal Resin for us. Who needs Jade? Um, so, Rudolph's not really... I mean, I could still promote Rudolph just so he has the extra TP. Oh, wait, no. Rudolph's already promoted. Okay, well then it'll probably be Maxwell then. Um, 
I guess... Should I still promote Maxwell? If I'm only going to be using 10 units in the battle... I was really happy with having Flanagan. So I have to basically decide if I want to use Rudolph or Maxwell. I mean, there's not very many other people that I can upgrade. A lot of my people are already, uh... Maxed, and we did get two of these. Which is, uh, important to note. Um... Let's go ahead and promote you, Maxwell. If we could get your revive ability, that would be very clutch. Come on, Divine Spear. Very weird that you don't say anything in a lot of these cutscenes and stuff, but... Hard effort grants a boon. Cool. So, you've been upgraded. Now, who else would we want? Uh, Narv. Probably Narv. If I'm going to be honest. Probably Narv. I forget what Benedict's ultimate ability is, but I might not even be able to get it anymore. Grants immunity to silence, fury, and temptation. It's gotta be, gotta be my boy Narv. Even if just for the cool purple robes. I'm stronger than I thought. Damn right you are. All right. Uh, those people are upgraded. Let's look at any upgrades I could possibly get over here on the units I'm actually going to be using. Um, yeah, not anything super crazy there. Huet, nothing really. Milo, increased physical defense. Look at these things. Boy, do I not care. Um... Get you some HP, Narv. Do I? I think I, I use the sacred uh, bow. Who uses a jade? Oh, Archibald of all things, of all people, Archibald. I could get it just to see what your ability is. Let's uh, do that really quickly. Hey, Archie. Um, let's let's go ahead and get that jade off of you. Just to see. I really shouldn't be wasting time with this if I want to keep this video of a uh, acceptable length, but I don't know. Boom. So what do we got? Uh, increased range, increased weapon potency, charge for one turn, then deal physical damage to enemies in a straight line of 10 squares, ignoring their defense. Eh. Not actually crazy about that. Um, not actually crazy about that, I'll be honest. Increased range of normal attacks by one could be good. The only problem with Archibald is he's not nearly as upgraded as, a uh, Rudolph is. Yeah, I'm good. Rudolph, sure, take some, uh, extra luck, friend. And... Uh, Medina, you take, uh... Let's get, like, Frederica HP. That was an option, right? And Nar... or Narv HP. Yeah, sure. Increased HP. And... that's basically it, except for... <laughs> damage on you. No, I'm good. Uh... Sure, we'll grab you one of these. Or should I wait in case I get something? Let, let's just save the rest of our resources. <clears throat> Is there another one of these? Nope. Alright. I'm really happy, actually. <laughs> um, let's see. We're good on most things. I'm gonna buy... Ooh, not that... You know what? Screw it. We're almost at the end here. Sure. That many large HP recovery pellets. Who's gonna stop me? Um, Cure-all pellets, temptation, thunderstones. We're good on spices and everything. Um, no new accessories uh, populated, right? No, nope, we can't buy any more bracelets. Uh, I could buy another strength amulet. That might not be a bad call. Um, and a magic amulet as well. Yeah. Yeah, that might be, that might be a good call, actually. Alright. And... So I got another strength and another magic. So you have a magic ring, Narv has a magic amulet. Frederica, enjoy your upgrade to a amulet. 
And I have another strength amulet to pass around. Who needs it? You got a bracelet. You have an accuracy and speed amulet. Roland has that. Um, let's put it on... Uh, let's, let's remove the speed amulet and put the strength amulet on instead, Maxwell. There you go. So, yup. And did I ever use that second upgrade? Yeah, I used it on Narv, that's right. Sorry, I'm just trying to go through everything in my head to make sure I got everything good. All right, let's go. Let's see what we got here. Okay, ooh, huh, wow, this late, this late. <laughs> While out scouting, Hewitt happens upon an eccentric researcher who has collapsed from exhaustion. I think I know who this is. I mean, obviously at this point we're not gonna use them, but uh. Is that? Still breathing, but I need to get her to a healer quick. St stone. What was that? I'm not giving you the Philosopher's Stone. I've seen Full Metal Alchemist. My stone. You mean this thing? That's my precious stone. I can't believe we're getting a new unit this late. All that grinding I did and. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> you have my thanks for saving me earlier. It looks like you made a full recovery. If you don't mind my asking, what were you doing there in the first place? My apologies. I am Giovanna, a scholar from Esfrost. Okay, yeah, I think I know who this is. I was doing research on Norzellian geography at the archives there. It's always been my dream to uncover the secrets of this land. Secrets? Secrets of what manner? All kinds! Our realm is full of them. Have you never wondered why only Hyzant is blessed with a lake of salt? Or why snow only falls in Esfrost? Do you not muse upon where the rushing waters of the Norzelia River flow from, and to? Come to think of it, we do not know, do we? There's an explanation for everything, and I want to... No, I must know it all. That's why I read everything I could get my hands on in the archives and keep searching for answers to this day. That still doesn't explain why you were out there. Well, you see, uh... Gustadolf decreed that all books on the land itself were classified information and ordered me to stop my research. So I left Esfrost in search of a place I could continue my pursuit of knowledge. But I'm not made for traveling, which is why you saw me in such an embarrassing state out there. I see. In that case, you are welcome to stay here until you decide your next destination. Truly, thank you ever so much, my lord. If there's anything I can do in the meantime, please let me know. I'm certain my knowledge will be of some use to you. I fear a scholar like yourself wouldn't be much help in battle. Not so. Why, I know everything about Norzelia's terrain. Your knowledge may indeed serve to help us refine our strategies and gain advantages over our foes. Oh, and might I mention this? My word, that is quite a talent indeed. See, I dare say I'd be useful in a fight after all. In that case, I ask you to assist Huet in scouting. You mean I can ride on her hawk and see the land from above? Oh, it would be an honor, my lord. We aren't flying up there for the scenery. Scouting is serious work. My apologies, I was just so excited. I'll count on you to get her up to speed, Huet. I will be on my very best behavior.
Understood. Giovanna joined your forces. So, um, this character, I believe, is the one that um, we get. It's actually the hardest stat to grind. I think this is the one that requires 1600 liberty. Um, I thought this was the mathematician, because there's a mathematician that you can get. But, um, no, this is the geologist. And, um, yeah, this is the one for that's like the hardest stat to grind. Apparently, I did get that. Um, if I'm, if I, I, I looked up online really quickly while that was going on, um, and everything. You know what, let me just, uh, confirm really quick, uh, optional characters, triangle strategy. So, let's see, this will tell me what each of them, uh, require, I do believe. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Giovanna uh, is the 1600 Liberty Conviction requirement. Um, so that's who we got for this. So an eccentric researcher whose abilities prove potent under only under particular conditions. Usable abilities change depending on the terrain beneath her feet. The greater her TP, the greater her attack power. Um, this is interesting because it reminds me of the Geomancer class from Final Fantasy Tactics, and I usually love any kind of character in a game that uses nature magic. Um, so she will be cool to use if I ever decide to do a new game plus playthrough of this on my own time. But, uh, I don't think she's going to be used here. Because, uh, she's completely unupgraded and stuff. But I'm happy I was at least able to see her and show her off. So, all of my grinding was not for naught. Also, she's cute. I like her hair and everything. I like her hair. Look at her. She's she's cool. And she uses a pickaxe as a weapon. Kind of badass. Um, grants one TP when moving five or more squares. Physical damage to a single enemy. Conditions: flatland, rock, pavement. Deal non-elemental magic damage to enemies in a line with a chance to immobilize them for two turns. That is very good. Uh, grants HP to an ally. Yeah, she can heal. But you have to specifically be on certain squares, which is the problem. Increase your strength and magic attack, the greater your TP, the greater your, uh, the boost. So, you are a very, very interesting character who I unfortunately am not going to be able to use. Um, yeah, that's a bummer, but at least I got her. At least all that grinding that I did was not for nothing. Um, I'm really surprised Liberty is the stat that I hit 1600 in first. I really thought it would have been... One of the other two stats, utility or I forgot the other one, um, because it seemed like a lot of my decisions and things lean towards those and they're the easier ones to grind. So I really didn't expect Liberty to be the one. You need not concern yourself over me. I know better than expect us to ever be friends. I'm here as a soldier bent on ending this war once and for all. I will repay the debt I owe you tenfold in the battlefield. I am yours to command. I just wanted to talk to these two. Greetings, Lord Saranoa. How are you faring today? Oh, me? I'm as fine as can be. Huet and I are fast friends, or at least I think we are. I was so sure of myself when I left Esfrost, but I soon learned that there are only so many things I can do alone. Which is why I am so thankful to you, my lord, and swear to repay you someday. There's so much I can learn here with House Wolfort. You're adorable. I love your design and the little bit that I've seen of your character. You're cool. I wish I could have gotten you sooner, but... What can you do? Let's hop in. That was a nice little surprise. I didn't even know we could still recruit characters this late. Minister Lila. Oh, Lila. Must we really fight? We must. Please surrender. You have a gift. A power to save the lives of many. Use your abilities for the good of Norzelia. I swear we will not put your power to wicked ends. <laughs> I fear I must decline. Why? Someone as keen as yourself must have seen through the goddess's teachings long ago. I was a willing accomplice to the Hierophant. Minister Serenoa, the world you would forge is a righteous and just one. I dare not taint it with these bloody hands. So why are you going to try and stop me? You could at least, like, let me walk past you. Minister Lila. But I will not beg for forgiveness. As one of the saintly seven, I have a duty to fulfill. 
Come, Walfort heretics! You shan't lay a finger on the Holy One! Then there is no turning back for us, either. I don't know how you can say that with a straight face, considering you basically just told yourself and all of your soldiers that you don't believe in that shit anymore, but okay. We will cut you down if we must. Alright, Lila, let's go again. I gotta try and have Medina attack you to see if there's anything that happens there. Oh boy. Okay. Let's get in here. Alright, how many units do I get? Unit placement? I get 10, as is expected. So... Let's see, who do I want to roll here? So... <clears throat> Huet, you're definitely... Definitely, definitely going over here. Um, swap you for that. Uh, Flan you and Flanagan will be quite useful over here, I feel. Um, you two will be pretty mobile. Mm. I would like to... Ooh, yeah, we can't move too many people over here. That is unfortunate. Okay, well, Narv, you stay over there. Um, and Milo, you're pretty fast. You can, you can stay over there as well. Um... Actually, no, just move down there with them. I think those three can take care of things over there. Uh, I would like to have... No, you know what? Screw it. Let, let's let's swap out Narv for Milo. Uh, there's not going to be a healer with you guys now. That's why I was leaving Narv with you guys. But Narv's going to have a lot of targets to hit over here and a lot of really physically tanky ones. Um, so I like the sound of that. I don't think I actually will use Rudolph for this fight. I, I prepped him just in case, but... Um, I think I would rather use other people. So, let's go ahead and get to it, I suppose. <clears throat> if you've made it to this point of the video and the LP, you're a saint. Not one of the saintly seven, mind you. A real saint. <sighs> we Lego. are the last bastion of the faith. Do not let a single heretic near the Holy One's palace. All soldiers, march! The palace is within our reach! Yeah, I think my hypothesis was correct. I think we have another fight after this, even. Because Edor has whatever shit he was over there giggling about. Okay. So it's come to blows. Ooh, and you're actually moving immediately. Wow, what a concept. Um, okay. Well then. That's, uh, gonna be problematic. There's no point in me moving up on you that quickly. So we're just gonna stay right here. Let you stupid idiots come to me. Okay, and these are specifically elites, which makes them a lot scarier. Uh, let's see. If I moon jump... I would love to taunt this rogue. Um, moon jump right Can here. Me? And 72? Yes, that's good, that's I good. Okay, that. you'll run up there and be annoying there. Okay, I'm just gonna hold you right there, Maxwell. Come at me, doofuses. Let's go. Okay, and you can get up here. Um, horizon range. Let's see, if I focus set... Eh. Let's see, I can shoot you. Very low chance to hit. I can't help but notice. Um... Let's blinding arrow this idiot. Darkness I think. You. Oh, it didn't work. Really hoping it would've. For the honor of House you just raised the tempted unit strength. Bold strategy, Cotton. We'll see how it pays off for him. Uh, yeah, it pays off for him. Boom. For my kith and kin. Big XP drop. Whatever it takes. Sarah Noah's a uh, pretty low level, all things considered. Um. Yeah, let's go ahead and fast acting medication, Thank Frederica. You. So Frederica Allow can me. go next. We can move Frederica right up here. She can drop some fire on these stupid assholes. Boom. Sound and strong. Yeah. I don't like that we're back to the elites now. Um, now that the elites are back, things are a uh, lot spookier. Um, 
I could kill this dork by doing that. Okay, if I do that... Okay, I can't kill. Yeah, Narv doesn't quite have the damage. Okay, let's just spark this idiot. It's a guaranteed kill. And those guys are very annoying because of their stupid counter. Boom. Owie. Okay, you got cured. That makes sense. That checks out. You uh -huh. won't beat me! Uh you. I would like to taunt you. Look to my shield! There we go. I gain new You're granting strength. TP. Annoying, Shut but it it's not the need? worst. Alright, Flanagan. Uh, I'm gonna need you to uh, aerial My assault charge. right up to this doofus. My work bears there we are. You're up I there. Lead by example. Where are you going, Lila? I won't Ooh. allow you to set foot near the palace. This heresy ends now. Now behold my power. Ooh, my that's not good. Uh, don't like that. No likey. Um, get four dragons. You that goes through your defense specifically. Um, if I double thrust you, yeah, see, four dragons is definitely where it's at here. Because I'm pushing through that big chonky defense that you've got. Okay, you can throw daggers, right? Yeah. Ooh, you missed, though. Cool. Um, god, I love this music. I love it so much. Let's see, I could run through, or I could triple thrust. Hitting both of them could be nice. That one's gonna die from from some magic next. Let's just triple thrust you. Went well. There we go. All right, tempted friend, go do some work. Ooh, ow! <laughs> that would have been really cool, but. Uh, Medina, I want to save your TP as much as possible, so I'm just gonna use some basic things here. Like, uh, here this. Are turning. Uh, I'm I shouldn't have wasted that on Sarah Noah. I should have used it on Narf. Um, I want to save up for your ultimate ability because then I can heal these guys even though they're all the way over here. Um, let's see here. I could hit you with some green mist and then just jump away. Oh, wait, no, I can't because, yeah, I would have had to jump first. That is my bad. Um, I could blinding arrow you. Yeah. There we go. You're blinded. That's good. That might be needed. They're definitely in a hairy situation over there, but we're... I think we can pull it off. Um, let's see. I can sweeping slash... Um, what would be a better call, though? So do you guys have the counter? You do have physical counter, but it's, it specifically has to be physical. Okay. Um, yeah... Um, don't really know what to do with you. Let's, uh, go right here and hawk dive you specifically. There we go. That's what I wanted. Okay, you're healing up. That's annoying. Um, that's two deaths right there. Yeah. Two kills. I will take it. Move back. You're still pissed off at Eridor, so you're not nearly as much of a problem. Although these shield bearers can actually hurt quite a bit. Um, let's see. Could I see breath? Spark wouldn't quite kill. That healer does have a turn coming up. I don't like that. Yeah, that's annoying. Um, boom. Yep, you're gonna heal. I'm ready to do what I must. Obnoxious. Blade casting on you. Not good, Flanagan. I'll take you on. Um. Okay, they're still taunted on you, Eridor. Um. Let's see here. Move, move rates. Right. Yeah, Eridor's looking a little hurt here. I want to kind of try and save your TP a little bit. <sighs> Ah, uh, that's gonna get you countered. Why'd I do that? I wanna try and save your TP a little bit so you can use that other thing. God, you're still stopped. 
Ooh, that's not good. Flanagan's in a bad spot. Um, I could in tandem your turn so that you explode now and then you can run. Hmm. Or I could restore to just get rid of them completely, but I would be wasting the heal. Let's, I should have used this earlier, just as soon as you got stopped. Quite honestly. Oh, it got rid of the bomb, but not the stop. Oh. Does it only get rid of one? That might have been what it said. It might have been my bad. Um, alright. Uh, what else are we going to be doing? You're just an elite blade. I think I'm going to stab both of you. It's not going to do much damage, but it'll help a little bit. You're still tempted. Boom. Prepare to face the dawn Good spear. stuff. Uh, let's move right here, and you can lance roll this idiot. Yourself. Put your back to that. Uh, Medina, you can almost use what I want you to. Go ahead and... Go ahead. I was going to get you to heal Eridor, but actually, fast-acting medication, help. Frederica. Frederica, do the honors. With the powers in me Boom. For a Two deaths world. right there. Just like that. God, Frederica is so strong. Choices. Choices. Ugh. <sighs> Fours when you go. Um, who can you be hit by? Uh. Okay. Um. Yeah, not in a very good spot here. Um. I might just moon jump out of here. Uh, yeah, I think we're out. Ooh. Okay, that works. Alright. Best idea. You learn Stardust. Um, what does that do, exactly? Chance to paralyze all enemies within range for two turns. That's pretty damn good. All right. Um, move back here. Uh, move right here and use an extra large HP recovery pellet on Huet, just for safety's sake. You're very evasive, so I'm not super worried about you. Flanagan's crazy tank. Here I come. He's crazy tanky, but not if you do that. Um. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Just uh, go ahead and evacuate him really quickly. Um, and you can move over here. Uh, I want you to be able to. There we go. Seventy-two percent chance. Please. There we I go. Will fight to my last breath. Okay. Okay, I think Flanagan the should be fine. Uh Saranoa, get over here. Um let's see, if I do it from over here. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, but that didn't count as the follow-up shit. I thought I was getting the follow-up attack specifically. Oh, impossible. Maxwell! This is a hard fight. This is a hard fight. Um, I've got to be a little bit more careful than I have been. You're still oh, furied. So we're fine there. You're healing. You, that is fine. Um, okay, Maxwell's good for now. Um, Maxwell is good for now. Medina's turn is coming up, so we'll be able to get over there and take care of that. Narv, just move back a bit. Or... Narv, since you don't have anything else to do on your turn, extra large on Eridor. There we go. You're backing up, because you guys are going to go back over there and cower behind each other. Um, you, I can do a murder on. Bye-bye. There we go. Oh. I won't lose! We're pulling it off, people. Um, you uh, push back. Yeah. Away with you. There we are. From no danger. Good stuff. All right, you can dodge that. It's fine. I'll do my utmost. Ooh, you didn't actually get put to sleep, did you? No, good, good shit. 
Okay, that would have been pretty bad, actually. All right, got to extra large it. I shan't hold back. All right, Maxwell, go ahead and do your thing here. I could triple thrust, but that's a little bit of extra damage. What if I lance hurl instead? We still get the follow up. Well. Die already. Yes. There we go. Less damage, but a little I bit safer. Okay, Lila, get your ass down here. Come on, lead by example. Um, blazing chains. That is a kill. Yeah. Stay right there. That way you don't get an action. <laughs> now what to do? Um. I still need to keep running with you. You guys need to kind of regroup. Now. Yeah. Yeah, Flanagan might be boned. Even with all the things I've done to try and save him. Owie. Um, Shadow Stitch you? 63% chance to hit. Let's see. I have enough for a focus. Let's focus through. for that increased accuracy. And let's try to Shadow Stitch this dork. Take Please? It. Yes. Alright. Good stuff. Good. Forward. If I can get Medina over there next round, that would be ideal. I don't know that I'm going to be able to, though. Uh-huh. You have extended range. You're still sitting up there being annoying. Here I come. They're running out of units, though. Uh, Narv. Ooh, you can get the heal to them. You can actually get it to the two that matter a little bit more. Good shit, Narv. I haven't used your heal in a very long time, but that was a very clutch one. I shall be victorious. Your goal. Uh, move back. Move back. Yeah, it's right there. Looks good. Okay, Flanagan. I'm ready to do what I You're back. The fruit of wisdom. Ooh. You hate to see it. You're immobile, so you can't really do much. Whatever it takes. Um, let's move you back a little bit. Let's move right here. And large. Yeah. Give here us some go. TP back. Okay, I'll, I'll be able to do the on. big heal now. It's come uh, soon coming up. Uh, I'll save King Shield. On my honor as the Dawn Spear. Uh. I would like to run up there with you and kill this stupid archer that's being very annoying. I'm not totally sure you could handle them, though. And would Traverse even get you to where I want you to be? It would get you right here. Which isn't awful. That would kind of put you far away, though. But you have Traverse. It's fine. Get up there and uh, smack this person. Um, okay, does, does Lila have AoE attacks? Um, single enemy, all enemies within range, I don't want to get temporal suspensions. I would like to get some damage down, but I really don't want to get hit by that. Oh, you don't have the TP for it. Okay, okay, never mind. Let's move right here, Blazing Chains you. Stay right there! <sighs> Gotta take your ass down. Clear skies, love to see him. <laughs> no, so Noah, what to do? um, yeah, you can go ahead and get out of there. Start building your shit up. Probably gonna on. need you in a second. Um, could shoot you. Yeah. You're gonna try and shoot me, but you're blinded. Sure. Or you're not gonna do anything. Interesting choice. Uh, could flash of steel you. I think I'd rather just save up for four dragons, though. Yeah, let's do that. So it's come to blow. Ooh, you're gonna move back like a little baby. Okay. That is fine with me. I I oh, I hate you. Oh, I hate you. Um, let's uh, drop one of these on Milo. Yeah, she's gonna play. She's gonna play the long game, backing up into her stupid units for backup. Okay, you got healed. Alright, Medina's good now. Um, let's drop one of uh, these on Eridor. There we go. 
Eridor, start getting in there, friend. Unfortunately, I can't King Shield yet, but I you're tanky. I believe in you. Uh, I could triple thrust you. Yeah. So it's come Sarcher can't uh, keep doing this forever. Delayed casting, delayed damage. My time has come. Uh, Flanagan. Um. Yeah, you can't quite get in there like I would like. Um, get over here and I fortify. One and all. There we I go. Will end this. Um, ooh, if only I could get a little bit closer. Can I hit? I can. Bye bye. There we go. My turn. And we're good there. Lila, I dare your ass to come back down here. I double dog dare your ass. You're probably just moving back while you get some TP, but that's fine because I'll be able to wear down your units. Hawkeye, that's what you chose to do. Saranoa's back. Uh huh. Let's see, I could blinding arrow, shadow stitch you. Let's, uh, shadow stitch another. you if possible. Nope. Alright, the rogue is still trapped over there because of that immobility. With These healers need to go. They need to go really badly. Whatever it takes. Um. Let's see here. Still not a ton for you to do. Let's, uh, drop a fortifying spice on... The rest to me. Oh, shit, that was just physical defense. I, Yeah, he already has physical defense up. Um, I meant to do a magic one. Sorry, brain's going a mile a minute right now. Alright. Good, good paralysis. I'll take you on! Uh-huh. Um, you. Can I provoke you, please? Nope. Sure can't. Oh, Ooh, I should have king shielded. I should have king shielded. Um. Ah, uh, the next turn's your bomb. Uh. Oh boy. Um. Could in tandem. Medina. Yeah, God, that slow she uses is fucking horrifying. Uh, okay, you need to get back down from there. Traverse All over my here. Mind design. And get right there. Medina can get in there and drop a good heal on Eridor and probably not die herself. Um, extra large HP recovery pellet. Yes, you're going to need it. I'm here to help. Lila's just gonna back up like a stupid, stupid bastard. Um. Mm. Uh, could Flash of Steel you? It wouldn't do enough damage to really make a difference. We'll just go ahead and guarantee kill this unit before you get healed. <laughs> now what to do? Uh huh. He's right there. The Frederica, advance. Uh, go ahead and. They, they don't have any physical attackers left. Except for that guy, but he's all the way over there stuck with an arrow in his leg. But he can move again, finally. Forward. Owie. Forward, indeed. We just gotta start moving. We gotta start moving, this people. Over yet. Um... God, if only I could hit you. Can't hit you either. Okay, just move over here. And we're just gonna wait for Medina's next turn. Yeah. God, I hate these stupid healers. I didn't want this, Minister Lila. You are the last person I wish to cross swords with. You have a silver tongue, Minister Serenoa. It has brought you far. You don't belong here in Hyzant. There is a greater world open to one of your wisdom. Hyzant is where I was born, and it is where I shall die. Such is the decision I made on that day so long ago. 
I'm realizing now I left that spoil up there, but that's... I was so focused on getting uh, Maxwell out of there so he didn't get, like, picked off by Lila or something. Then so be it. I stand ready. All right. Um, Flanagan. Let's let's get you in there. Let's get you in there, big guy. How about it? Like uh, right here. Let's see. What is the range on that bomb? I wonder. I think if I move right here, you're still fine. Give me strength. There we go. It's just a bunch of healers. What are they gonna do? They're gonna sit there and die, basically. Um. Uh, large ranged. I need to use that. So let's get over here and drop those. Time for some sorcery. Uh, Narv, you can just move up there and collect that. Maxwell, you don't have enough TP to do anything too crazy. You could lance hurl that idiot, or you could traverse right here. Get a uh, follow up with Flanagan. There we go. Look forward to seeing. You learned revive. That'll be useful. That'll definitely, definitely be useful. Uh, flash of steel out of you would be pretty good. There we are. Uh, Milo. Let's see, Stardust. Range one to one. Uh, I think I see where I want to get to if I can pull it off. Nope. What about there. That works. And Stardust. Everyone around me. 60% chance. Okay, we got the we got the melee guy. Good. <clears throat> cool. And Frederica. If you would so kindly right there. I am grouping people up close to Eridor though. I think the damage is just these squares around him. So I think we're like um what's his face there is? Flanagan. I think that's safe. Heed my call. So I think Withdraw we're good. your troops, Minister Lila, to insist on fighting his folly. One day you will understand a mother's love, the willingness to sacrifice for something greater than yourself. I've come too far to look back now. This is all I have. I shall lead by example. For the honor of House Okay. Walford. Wow, you didn't do anything. Um, interesting. Um, I can't really get Saranoa in a good spot without Eridor murdering him. So, uh... Let's see, I could do one of those. I could do one of these. I think I should just kill you. That's a healer dead. Here I come. And another healer dead is always good. Uh, 26% chance to immobilize you. Um, if I sight set, how many people do I have eyes on? Not enough to make it worth it, in my opinion. I think I'd rather just start working this guy over. I didn't actually know that was blind. Whoopsie. I didn't know I had selected that. For the greater good. Heals. Okay. Let's see. Eridor, you are about to take magic damage, my friend. So... Warding Here spice, please. I'll keep on then. My time has come. Uh huh. Flanagan, we can move over here. You can shield bash the Stupus. I'll show you what I can do. Narv. Yeah, right there. And hit them with an icy breath. Ice. Yep. There we go, and we got the good spoils. No. <clears throat> we mustn't let our holy ground be tainted. Oh, it's gonna be tainted. I won't lose. With your blood. Uh, let's see here. Don't want to get next to Eridor once again. Could I. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah. There we go. I didn't think that was actually gonna work, but I stabbed Prepare through the wall. Prepare to face the Dawn Spear. 
Alright, um, I could triple thrust you and run, or nope, let's just kill the healer. It's just gonna be Lila. Okay, things were looking a little sketchy there for a bit, but, um, we're looking pretty good. Oh, there's still one more turn before it goes off. Oh. Well then. Um, hello. You'll have to get me. Oh yeah, you're immune to it. Damn. That's fine. I didn't take the damage, though. <laughs> uh, okay. Heart Stealer on you. 80% chance to go off. There we are. Don't have to worry about that unit now. Milo is so good. Alright, can you help me kill that archer, please? I fight for peace. You did absolutely nothing. Okay. Well then. Um... Scorch. There we are. Here I come. Sarah Noah stops. Frederica can focus and get that kill. I will fight to my last breath. All right, Serpent Slayer, boom, dead, good. Oh hell yeah, you are. No question. Um, poison pellet. This this won't even really work, but I just want to see if you have something to say. You do not. Damn. Even now, I struggle yes. to understand the words you said that day. To see the wisdom in them. Finally! I found Medina's interaction! Yes! And my time with the Wolf Forts has given strength to my convictions. I know now to look inward if I am to move forward. That is the only way I can live unburdened by doubt. You are yet a student, and know nothing of the way of the world. Even so, I am afraid I can offer you no mercy here. Uh, she's on the wrong foot. We're gonna be the ones that you need to be begging for mercy. Charge. Do you see how this battle's going, Lila? Doesn't seem like you do. Go in there, Roland. To face the dawn spear. Jump your horsey across the rooftops. You get in there too. Uh, traverse right Look there. Carefully. I'm a coming. Uh, that doesn't work. That is I hope fine. You're watching, grandfather. Oh, I'm sure he is, Narv. I'm sure he is. It was so cool when Narv had an interaction with um, Edor. That was amazing. I wonder if you have an interaction with Lila as well. Um, we're gonna need somebody to pick up a bunch of these things, but uh, right now let's just continue to move here. Yep, you're tempted. You're still my, uh, my friend. Choices, choices. Cool. Go over there and get that, Milo. You're not gonna be of, uh, much use at these, any of these other places anyway. There we are. Scrape all of those up. Wow, that was, uh, quite the decision you just made. Well then. Chains. Saranella stops. Uh, yep, Hewitt. That is a dead rogue. I love this squad. Um, that is kill. Do I? Would I rather give it to anybody else? There's that. There's that thing right there. I would like. I could pick up, but at this point, I don't really care, man. And I'm fine with the mentor and students getting a co-op stab here. Yeah, look at this! No, no. It's oh, over. Maxwell didn't stab. They've won. Beautiful. Alright, now Roland, you gotta go sit in the corner away from everybody else for a little bit until that bomb goes off. <laughs> Roland, Roland just has to go sit in the corner of the encampment for a while. <laughs> Oh, this is a good game. I love this game. <laughs> now I will finally be united with the goddess. I can be at ease, away from this world of suffering. No, we won't let you die. Gila, tend to her wounds. Yes, my lord. Stop! 
What are you doing? My life is meaningless. There is only pain in this world. We came here to change that. To build a new world, a new future. Ugh, oh, I mean... I hear you, Saranoa, but God, she had the opportunity and insisted on fighting this anyway. We're literally just forcing her to take our mercy option now when she could have saved us a hell of a lot of trouble by just letting us walk past. I, I mean, I'm all for forgiveness and everything, but geez, dude. She had her opportunity. We told her. We were like, we're here to fix things. All you have to do is just not fight us. And she insisted on fighting us anyway. Because she's like, my hands are already too dirty. So, yeah, I mean, I'm not saying that Lila deserves to die here, but I don't think Lila should just be able to live in this new world without facing the repercussions for the things she did. She should be jailed for a very, very, very fucking long time. And maybe when she's at a ripe old age, she'll be able to come out and see the world she tried to stop from happening because of her stupid pride. Where you, where all people can find true meaning to their lives. True meaning. But to do that, Norzelia will need your knowledge and your skills. Your medicine can save lives. You can help people live to pursue their dreams. That's another way to, I mean, you are a very, very good physician, apparently, so you can do your recompense by helping heal people in the new world. Minister Lila, you must live and atone for your past. Roland's got the idea of it. Still think it was dumb that you insisted on standing against us, but... Lord Saranoa, Lord Sparog has successfully gained control over the city. And Minister Lila is no longer in critical condition. Jerome is seen to her now. All that remains now are the Holy One and Minister Edor. Saranoa, I hope you don't mind, but... I wanted to thank you for getting us this far. I have come to realize that being king is not about one's status or blood. A king is someone who stands at the forefront and carves a path for his people. As such, I think you worthy of the title king. Though royal blood runs through my veins, I do envy you, my friend. Oh, Roland, if only you knew. <laughs> Thank you, Roland. I could not have done it without you or the others. Benedict just sitting over there, like, suppressing the desire to blurt out <laughs> what he knows. But this isn't over yet. The final battle is still before us. You said the final battle was two battles ago. Yes. To the Hierophant's Palace, everyone! Final battle for realsies this time? I guess earlier, they, when they were saying final battle, they were just talking about the series of fights that was going to lead to us winning this. The final war, if you will. All right, we've been at this screen once before. We ain't stopping. This tr this truck's still going. We still got half a tank of gas. Let's go. Can't stop, won't stop. I do this occasionally with my LPs when I just get too hyped for the ending. So we're in it. The path that House Wolfort walks leads them to the Hierophant's Palace. They stand before the doors, determined to bring about a new age of happiness for all in Norzelia. With conviction in their hearts, Serenoa and his friends take their final steps forward, knowing that where this path ends, another will begin. Final chapter for Norzelia. And the final battle. Just like that. Two character stories to look at, which um, I guess we will be checking out. Let's go to the encampment really quick because I have some people I can promote. Would it have killed you to give me a little bit more silver? I'm kind of amazed that there's not enough of the upgrade items to actually upgrade everyone's weapons um, in one playthrough, but I... That's 
it's probably not intended to upgrade every single person's weapon in one playthrough. That's probably a New Game Plus thing, so that's probably why that's, why that's there. Uh, I was just lazy and didn't want to do a whole New Game Plus run. So that would have been work. Um, well, you two are the only two I'm actually using in this battle, so... Besides Medina. Medina wouldn't be the worst option. Um... I'm gonna be honest, I just don't really care about the ability that, uh, Serenoa gets. I mean, yeah, yours is pretty good. We'll, we'll give it to Roland and Medina, I think. <laughs> funny, funny that Serenoa is going to be the one unit that's not fully upgraded at the On end, the main character. Sorry, Serenoa. Um... So, Medina, you are the other one. And you get Lady Luck. Yeah, it's not super useful, but... I honestly just want the extra TP on you. That is really it. Also, do you have the most HP of all of my units because of those two HP bracelets I have I on you? I hear the cries of those in need. Let's see if you have more HP than Eridor. You do. Oh, gods, by a lot. Flanagan actually has more HP than Eridor. Interesting. Flanagan is very tanky. Okay. That is that. My two units have been upgraded. Let's see if there's anything I can do here. Uh, could upgrade Saranoa, Roland, um, Eridor... Medina, Maxwell. Maxwell, you've been doing some work. You've been doing some work. There may be an update for you. An earn upgrade for you. Yeah, let's give it to Maxwell. Um, decrease DP cost of triple thrust, I think. And... Who else? Uh... Eh, Narv... Increased magic defense, sure. And Medina... F fine, Medina, here you go. Unless I wanna... I know it's screwed, here you go, uh... Archibald. Just in case this battle is like you can use 12 units. And, uh... Sure, Ana as well. Once again, just in case this battle is like you can use 12. There. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's look at our two character stories that have happened at probably the most climactic point in the game. We follow, uh, we we pause these final battle messages to bring you some Maxwell's story and Milo's story. This is like Dragon Ball Z, the middle of the Cell Saga, cell, fighting Cell, and it's like, well, let's let's you know flash back to some other things or just stand around and talk. I guess Naruto is a better comparison with all the flashbacks. That you would return to us hale and whole. Tis a much needed fortune in these trying times. Oh, we've seen this one. <clears throat> we've seen this one. Okay, that's one we don't have to watch. But uh, I don't think I even saw one Milo thing before. So this Milo one is definitely new. So, Milo? Ana witnesses Milo doing something unusual in secret. Wait, was this is this just the plant ones again? Did, is this just the same one I had before, but I'm getting it again? Let's find out. Okay, no, this is different. <clears throat> oh, I thought I told you not to sneak up behind me like that. It's been some time since a bird came from Hyzand, hasn't it? Huh. <sighs> So you were spying on me. Did Wolfort order this? No. Lord Saranoa is not the type to have his people surveilled. But as his retainer, I would be remiss not to keep an eye out for those who might intend him harm. I suppose there's no fooling you. Yes, I am Hyzan's spy. Do what you will with me. I fear neither torture, nor execution. We would gain nothing by doing either. A plant may be poisonous or medicinal, after all. 
Depending on how we use you, you could still serve House Wolfort. I am a human being. Do not liken me to a mere object. Even tools have feelings. You said it yourself, no? So you did hear me. You should understand this by now, Milo. Lord Saranoa would never use you, or any of us, as mere tools. Indeed, he is too trusting. He would be easy to poison, had I a mind to do so. Grant peaceful sleep to the wounded beast. What is the meaning of this? Should House Wolfort rise in opposition to Hyzant, Saranoa is to be killed. It's a coded message. I only just received it. My master sees me as nothing but a tool. Now that my identity has been found out, my life is as good as forfeit. My master disposes of tools once they are no longer useful to him, you see. But he cannot dispose of me if I dispose of him first. Then you will aid us. No, I will use you. I may be a tool, but I have my pride. I came here seeking power that I might protect myself. To avoid being disposed of, I needed to align myself with a strong house. You're a tough one, aren't you? As tough as a weed, and poisonous too. All right, well, some new information about uh, Milo there. That came at a really good time, considering we're about to kick in the door and kill uh, Edor, so. Serano and his allies ready themselves for one last battle, one that would put an end to the War over Salt and Iron for good. Level 35, recommended level. All right, we're at the two hour and 40 minute mark, but we're here. There's no one here. Lord Saranoa, perhaps it is time we see the true face of the Hierophant. But this is... What's the matter, Saranoa? It's just a doll. Edor was the one pulling the strings the entire time. I mean, that's what I said is the problem with those sorts of things. a machine yep yeah I mean you're you're not you have to you have to still believe that the speaker is telling the truth if you there or the translator is telling the truth perhaps they left it here after the true hierophant fled the palace No one has ever seen behind these curtains, which could only mean... Step away from the Holy One, you insolent swine. You mean to say this doll is your Hierophant? Just so. You should feel honored to be the first to learn the truth. This is the truth? Ooh. You forget your station. No matter. She can be replaced. Was there ever a person behind those curtains? Or were the words you spoke on her behalf? All his, yes. So you were pulling the strings in Hyzant all along. The Holy State needed a leader. Had I not given it one, our nation would have long since fallen. Ooh. I hate you. Three decades ago, as the Salt Iron War raged on, the previous Hierophant fell ill. 
At a time when we most needed unity, the Saintly Seven began bickering amongst themselves. All fell into chaos. Only I understood. The Saintly Seven were all so fallibly human. And no greedy human would ever be able to unite our people. Are you gonna reveal that you're a demon or some shit? <laughs> but none but a human can lead his fellow man. Not so. I realized that the goddess herself could guide them, for she is eternal and absolute. And the next Hierophant should be just the same. By my own hand, I crafted an undying Holy One who would lead this nation in the Goddess's name. You crafted a living thing. Minister Lila's research made it all possible. She is an undying machine, moved by the power of Elfric. She is as absolute as the Goddess herself. You were the one putting words in her mouth. You've done nothing but deceive your people this whole time. And what is so wrong with that? Unlike my fellow saints, I do this not for myself. Need you proof? Witness the peace and prosperity Hyzant enjoyed for decades. The people's faith in the goddess deepened and they rejoiced over her blessings of equality and happiness. Until you heretics ruined it all. Yeah, but that was all built on the back of the Roselle, you jackass. I will not deny wanting to bring happiness to the people. Any leader would want the same. Any good one, at least. However... I refuse to stand by as you preach lies and deceive those you were meant to lead. You betray your people's trust. People cannot make the right choice without knowing the whole truth. Keeping them in the dark makes it impossible for them to see the other paths before them. The goddess's path, your path, is not the only true one. Hyzant has deceived its people for many long years. They used the Roselle and tricked their own people. If that is truly what the Goddess believes, then she is evil incarnate. Enough of your senseless ideals. Pretty words alone won't save anyone. Humans are fools. The wise must protect them and show them the way. For fools, thinking is tiresome, decisions terrifying. Reality breeds discontent. Freedom gives rise to greed. Free will creates doubt, and ideals of justice lead to conflict. Ridding people of these things is the only true path to happiness and peace. Yeah, ridding people of their ability to make decisions and have an identity. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, this is a textbook one that idiots like this like to spout. How can you not see that the people want to be controlled? That is not your decision to make. People err in judgment. There are times when our hearts cloud our eyes to the right path. Call it foolishness if you want. But we can learn from our mistakes. We can find others to walk a new path with us. Denying that means robbing the people of their chance to grow. The people need neither a new path nor growth. They have me to show them what is right. Then we will do away with both you and your rule. Even if your puppets live forever, it won't mean a thing. No, my rule is immortal. 
The perfect Elfric has been completed. Yeah, that's the reveal I was waiting for. And now that it flows within me, I am as eternal as the Hierophant and the Goddess herself. So Elfric was a study on immortality. Your will is to live and control the people forever. Just what are they to you? They are my beloved children, adorable and pitiful in their foolishness and misery. You lie. You fear your people. You fear them learning the truth and denying your rule. You cannot accept the fact that you are as foolish as them. And it is out of this fear that you seek to control them. You are nothing but a coward, Edor. The Absolute fear nothing. Be gone from this world! No. If you are so absolute, prove it. Shatter our convictions. Very well then. It is time you knew the Goddess's true power. Alright, here's the reveal. You're gonna turn into like an angel looking thing or a monstrosity. One of the two. Like your cool model. More puppets? They are innumerable. And there is Zell. Do not falter. Our convictions will never be shaken. I love that Edor's model is like massive and more detailed. Friends of House Wolfort. It is time we end Edor's reign of deception. To arms! Together, we shall strike down this false saint. Let's do it, squad. Here we go, the final battle. Oh boy, yeah, this is it. This is it, right here. Defeat Edor, lose all allied forces. So I should probably focus on you, in particular. The Hierophant... Increases damage dealt, the greater TP, the greater the boost. Resist all, gain 1 TP, deal non-elemental magic damage. Summon a puppet. Chance to tempt all enemies, and deal non-elemental magic damage to all enemies with 3 or more TP? Oh god. And you're an automaton, yeah, and they have red hair. Uh, explode when defeated in battle, dealing physical damage, deal physical damage, physical damage and set the ground ablaze, okay. Do they all look like that? Yep, so they explode. Okay, so we're gonna want to kill the Hierophant, and then Edor. God, you can act twice. Look at your disgusting updated art. One instance of in invincibility at the end of your turn. Grant immunity to all status effects. Uh, draw in a single enemy and steal TP. One TP to an ally, raise their strength to an enemy and have a chance to paralyze them and summon the Hierophant on a selected square. So you can resummon the Hierophant if I kill them. That's no good. And the Hierophant can just summon. Okay, I just got a bum rush Edor. It's the only way this is going to work. It's the only way this is gonna work. I have to bum rush Edor, and we're just gonna have to deal with this the rest of this. Okay. Um. Yeah. The this is how this is gonna have to happen, huh? Um. Get up here, Flanagan. You get up here. Yeah. I mean, this is how this is gonna have to go. There's no other way forward for us. All right, um, I think that's about the best I can do. Let's get in there. This is the squad that's gonna kill God. Oh, the God Slaying Squad. I didn't see that any of them could heal Edor, so 
we at least have that going for us. Edor Delmira, in the name of the countless who have suffered under your cruel ambitions, I shall strike you down. You speak of ambitions as if they are anathema. But what is this but the result of your own lust for power? One of the saintly seven and the only one permitted to hear the voice of the Hierophant. Yeah, but now your art's changed. How many have you killed to stand here before me? How much blood has been spilled? There is only one truth, her truth, and I shall send you before her begging for mercy. Oh, I hate it. What? It's moving! Everyone, on your guard! Oh my god, I, I hate them. I hate them, I do. Uh, alright, let's, uh... Get in here, I guess. Um... I need to stab you, I think. The Hierophant needs to die, quickly. A ruler should be a vessel through which the people's desires are realized. But a leader without a soul cannot hear their pleas. Your rightful place is under the rubble of the church. Take that! For my kingdom! Oh boy, this is gonna be rough. Demigod, oh my god, you're actually moving. Choices, choices. You're actually moving to us. Um, do you guys resist temptation? You don't appear to, weirdly. Um, let's, uh, move Can right there, and, yeah, I, I do have a chance to actually tempt you. I've good. Never felt better. Okay, good shit, good shit. On my honor as ow! Speak. Holy shit, ow. Uh, triple thrust. I mean, we're we're doing big damage, but we we gotta we gotta get in there and kill Edor like ASAP. Um. Uh, I really need to start CCing some of these idiots, if possible. Or should I just focus on the Hierophant and then after that Edor? Uh, I can't mobilize you. Um. Yeah. No. Let's just focus damage on the Hierophant. I don't think we can waste time fighting these other things. Not with the kind of damage they just inflicted on Edor. Or, uh, Edor, uh, Eridor. That damage was ridiculous. Um. Yeah, uh. Hawk dive. Hawk dive. You're, you're gonna resummon the Hierophant, but once we kill you, we can advance on Edor. And you need to go ahead and just drop an extra you large on on him. I'll show you okay. what I can do. Uh Narv Uh Spark Ready. Spark. Okay. And we don't want to get hit by that attack that does damage to us if we have TP. I've been waiting for this. That would be a nightmare to deal with. Um, I can provoke you guys. Let's King Shield. You'll have to get through me. I don't want you I'll to have a bunch of TP. Peace. Um, can I Blazing Chains you? Yes, you're dead. When this battle is finished, the rot of the goddess's teaching shall be plain for all to see. I shall reduce you to scrap and restore the stolen honor of the Rizel. Blaine, heed my call. Dead. Okay, Arafant's dead. I think Edor can resummon it though, which I'm not excited about. But uh, it's fine. Shield bash. Shield bash. Okay, you're you're taunted on Flanagan. That's good. Ow. They they hurt. They hurt. <clears throat> Yep, and you just summoned another one. And you have another stack of invincible. Okay, no, you just, you still just have one. Um and yeah, you can just keep resummoning the Hierophant. 
we're just gonna have to start. I think we're just gonna have to start moving on on Edor. I don't. For too long has the rot between our three nations been left to fester. In the name of Glenbrook, I shall cleanse it here and now. And then what, my young king? Do you have the resolve to steer Nazaria on the right course? Perhaps once I would have said no to your question. But that was simply because I was afraid. Afraid to crawl before I could walk. But my friend showed me that at the end of suffering and uncertainty lies truth. I may be king by virtue of birth, but I will do all in my power to earn my title. Okay, that's a little bit of extra damage in. I need to teleport someone in there, basically. I don't know who, but someone needs to get in there. Um, Frederica, maybe? Frederica, maybe. Honestly, like, behind Edor is one of the safest spots I see right now. So, Frederica, get in there. Uh, I'm also going to in tandem you so that you can go again pretty soon. All right, cool. And... Maxwell, get in there, bud. Look carefully. We need all the this people we can in here. We just gotta bum rush this idiot. There's no point in fighting anybody else. You'll just resummon them. It is our ability to face death with dignity that makes human life precious. One who would forsake that has no right to lead others. And what have you done for your fellow man, Don Spear? Killed them time and again. Don't speak to me of humanity. Behold! You um. fools! Your chance for repentance is drawing to an end. I will end. Just got to get in there and bum rush, man. It's our, it's the only way. Uh, blazing chains. Blazing chains. Yep, that's big the damage. The have been freed, and the saintly seven are no more. Nothing remains of the high set you built, Edor. On the contrary, so long as I exist, so long as the hierophant stands, faith can be rekindled. And Hyzat's glory shall be reborn. History is written by the victors. Truth is made by the triumphant. You are blinded by your ambition, and perhaps have ever been. Norzelia shall not know peace until it is rid of you. Stay right there! Okay, next turn I get, I'm gonna try to missed, oppor missed opportunity, uh, Edor. Er, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, are you immune to this? Nope, you have a 100% chance of getting stopped. Yes, please. Screw you. Um, alright, move in there. Uh, fast acting medication... On... Yes. We're counting on you. We gotta go. We you gotta hustle. You the natural order. Giving life to the lifeless. You're beyond saving, Edor. All for the good of the people. For that, I will go to any lengths. Charge! If that's what you think, friends. Alright, double thrust. Or no, no, no. Four dragons, actually. Oh my god, that damage. <gasps> Freeze your last! Well met. Mmm. Mmm. Juicy. Juicy. You can't get your stupid invincibility if I just bum rush you, you idiot. <laughs> My judgment absolute! Choices, choices. Is your judgment absolute? Is that a fact? Moon jump. You won't know up from down. Get in there. Um, I unfortunately don't have enough to do much, but I can just bop you, you for 30 damage. You endlessly about justice, but what you truly fear is being denied. I love how everybody gets their shit talking in. Silence, child! What does one such as you know of my position? You overstep your bounds. <laughs> this battle is ours. Uh, Huet. Yep, we need to get you in there. Um, you can't hit Edor, really. What if you're right here? No. God, you're just not in range. You're just not in range to do it. Um. Okay, well, um, the only thing I can think of doing is, ah, oh, and you don't have enough for shooting star. Just shoot that thing. 
to do something. Yeah. You're furied. That's fine. Boom. Nope. Hawk dive. More big damage. Your misguided ideals threaten to corrupt the realm, Shevenor Wolfort. I shall cut off their spread at the source. Repent, and I shall grant you a swift death. I walk a path unclouded by doubt. A path of my own making. Come what may, my steps shall never waver. Ah! Now! Yes. Okay, you're gonna attack Flanagan, that is absolutely fine. You're gonna hit Eridor, also fine. You didn't, uh, get your shit. But you did get one of your invincibility stacks. Narv, um... You unfortunately can't do much, friend. Uh... I see... Mm, that's not gonna do much. Uh, quite honestly, just heal Flanagan. If you can't hit Edor, there's no point. You are so naive. Oh, they're moving in. They're moving in. We gotta hurry this up. Oh, that's not good. Uh, Medina, your turn's coming up. It's coming before them. Good. Uh... Let's see, Eridor, buff your shit. Buff your shit, friend. Um... Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um... Physical defense? Sure. Medina's turn is coming up. I'll be able to cure them. I can do it. Uh... Aerial Assault. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, Aerial Assault in there, Flanagan. We need as many troops as we can get in there. Oh my god, my cat is trying to walk across my desk. What are you doing, you fool? Why- why would you think you could just sit on my desk? Jeez. He just walked up and sat, like, right down on top of my, like, laptop- uh, on top of my keyboard. He's, like, never done that. Weird. Um... Oh boy. If only. If only. Pushback... Wouldn't do enough. Well, you would take two instances of damage. That would be useful, actually. Um, you can't make it to Maxwell to cure that taunt. Um, and oh wait, no, cure all. Oh wait, no, 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 that's, that's that thing. Damn it. Um, okay, yeah, do the pushback just because it destroys the invincibility and does a bit more. There we go. No danger. Good stuff. Uh, move back, Roland. You can but get back in there later. Back. Um... Alright. Move up, Medina. I'm gonna need you to double item. And I need you to cure all pellets. Let's see, you have two of the- yeah, we have two here of these. You, you. I'm here to help. And I need you to cure all here pellet you. you. That was a good camera angle. Okay, keep summoning them. I don't care. Drain life, you have another invincible. That's fine. Uh-huh. Uh, let's get rid of that invincible, why don't we? Now would be a good time to have Anna in this fight. Because she could break it and keep going. Over here. I'll make you proud, grandfather. Shall we dance? Oh boy. Uh that'll be more damage. Oh, you're so close. This about is mine. Boom. <gasps> Frederica. Frederica can have I the final hit. Peace. No. No one's allowed to die. All right, Frederica, with the chains, like the, like I talked about. Let's zoom in. That's as much as I can zoom in. I, I love the sprite work here. This is such a cool reveal. I love when, um, like, strategy uh, RPGs do this. This is it. Um, the only people who didn't get the oppor opportunity to say anything to him are Narv. I don't think Huet did. Flanagan. But I think everyone else got a chance to say something, and I don't, I don't want this to go bad, so I'm going to finish him off now. Do it. Stay right there for a better world. For a better world, indeed. Why? 
my divine rule was to last forevermore. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I ween. I just bum rushed him. We speed ran that shit. Oh. I, as soon as I saw that they could summon more allies, I was like, there is no point in trying to fight these enemies. I just need to get on his ass and never let go. <sighs> and it worked out. That's the only fight like that I can think about in the game so far. Where it's like, no, you really do just want to bum rush the boss. Yeah. Saranoa Wolfort. It must feel good to wield your blade for your ideals. There were, of course, other fights where, you know, killing the boss would make the fight end sooner, but those fights were easy enough that I wanted to kill all the units for XP and stuff, but this one, no. But you will regret it in time. Human greed will fill the void left behind by the goddess. Those you sought to bring happiness to will criticize and condemn you. I know, that is the fate of a leader of men. But I will never stop believing in people. I will walk beside them toward a better tomorrow. I once believed in the same ideals. I prayed to the goddess endlessly for the people's salvation. But she never answered my prayers and the people remained fools. Only then did I realize the goddess did not exist. That I had to save my people by mine own hand. Edor, why not put your faith in people once more? You would forgive even me. Oof. Yeah, JRPGs do like their forgiveness. I really don't feel like this jackass deserves it, though. Holy shit. You're a stronger person than I am, Saranoa. You must atone for your wrongs, of course. But after that, you would be free to walk a different path. Yeah, at least Saranoa's like, you have to atone. But, God, this jackass has caused so much suffering. I don't trust him as far as I can throw him. You naive fools. Yep. What have you done? See, Saranoa, this is why you don't do this shit. There should have been an arrow through his head like ten fucking minutes ago, Saranoa. Damn it! Not everyone can be saved. Not everyone's worth saving. I have activated the remaining Elfric in the palace. Soon, all will be reduced to dust. But why? Remember this, Serenoa Walfort. Not everyone is like you. Humans will never be cured of their stupidity. No matter how much you love your fellow man, inevitably, he will betray you. Be that as it may, I still choose to believe. <laughs> then know this. The path you would walk will lead nowhere but despair. I will await you in hell. The palace is collapsing! We must go now. Saranoa, run! Even if I sink into the depths of despair, I will find a path out. As long as I keep walking, there will always be hope. Couldn't you say this while walking, by the way? Hurry, Saranoa!
Oh. I was about to say, if Sarah Noah dies because of, he's an idiot and he's just standing around to talk shit to a dead body, I'm gonna be mad. Holy shit, did Sarah Noah have enough time to get away from that? He, he, he started running like the seconds Hierophant's before it went palace, off. Once a symbol of prosperity in the holy state of Hyzant, crumbles and sinks into the source taking Edor and his baleful puppets along with it. So it is that the long war that began with the unearthing of salt crystals comes to an end. Huh. Sorry, this is completely unrelated, but I've been trying to figure out what in the hell the stuff in the source was this entire time. Those, like, vain-looking things. And first off, they're the bridges that connect the source and everything that we've seen. And two, yeah, they're supposed to look like veins because the source is a heart. Sorry, I know. Probably years late to that uh, uh, revelation, but... The hearts of the Norzellian people are shaken to learn of the new sources of salt, the Roselan history of the land, and the end of an era of three warring nations. Once the Hyzantians learn the truth of the goddess's teachings, their influence is shattered, and the holy state descends into chaos. In Esfrost, the late Archduke's staunch followers refuse Farag's new rule. Fortunately, the tumult is short-lived. Serenoa, Roland, and their loyal companions show the way, espousing the tenets of a new Norzelia. One built around the ideals of mutual understanding and cooperation. Gradually, doubts are dispelled and anxieties allayed. Peace returns to the realm under the rule of King Roland of Glenbrook. And for the first time in history, all the people of Norzelia take their first steps on a new path. Together. Ooh, okay, so Roland became king. So, uh, Sarah Noah didn't let that detail drop. The hawk flies free. Okay, what happens? Sarah Noah going on a journey to find himself across the world? Is nobody gonna go colonize Centralia? <laughs> I mean, it's still down there. <laughs> Are you okay? Mm-hmm. Hey, let's go play hide and seek over there. Okay. I never thought I would see the day my people would be welcome anywhere. Yet here we are. It truly is a dream come true. Yep, this is a better ending for the Roselle than even the Roselle and Ralph. It took some time for everyone to adjust, but now... It feels like the Roselle have been here their whole lives. Aye. With things finally settling down here, the young lord and King Roland can move the people forward. One step at a time. Indeed. And we must do everything in our power to see their plans through. Frederica, how good it is to see you again. Glenbrook seems to have gotten back on its feet. It has, uncle. How fares Esfrost? Some of Gustadolf's most loyal followers resisted the change, but we managed to peacefully resolve our differences in time. Ain't that a relief? Truly, it is. I would be loath to sully Esfrost's history any further, and I am certain Dragan would agree. Well, well. To think dignitaries can stand about chatting in the open like this. What a world we live in now. Minister Lila, welcome. I hope your journey was a pleasant one. Man, what was she in jail for? Like two weeks? I mean, she still did some messed up stuff. 
I don't think she'd just be able to walk, walk free with no repercussions at all. You can scarcely imagine my surprise when I heard that King Roland had asked for me by name. Well, it did say it was like, uh... Didn't we have a time skip that said like two months or something like that, so... I don't know, I think maybe at least a, you know, a few years or so? You know? Turning people into bombs, forcing them to die and turning them into bombs? I, I don't know. In truth, I was unsure of whether or not to answer his summons. After everything I have done, I cannot imagine being worthy of such a lofty position. Of course you are, Minister. After the Hyzantian people lost everything they believed in, you were the one who kept them together. You also shared your research with the public. Countless lives were saved thanks to you. Well, shit. Okay. You're someone that's in the medical business um, that actually shares your stuff with the public. That's cool. Thank you for that. I am flattered you think so. But in the end, it was I who was saved. Yeah, I mean, Lila's... Uh... Doing her time in this way. Basically, community service, I guess. Not, not as harsh a punishment as I would have liked, but uh... You know, we need her for rebuilding, I guess. Haha! <laughs> Come now! Let us save the catching up for later. We must be on our way to the castle. Where is your dear husband-to-be, Frederica? He is with Benedict at Castle Wolfort, discussing the prospects of the new Salt Crystal Mines. They will make their way here once they're finished. Lord Serenoa is as ardent to youth as always, I see. <laughs> Are we going to get to see the wedding in the wedding dress? Would be neat. It has been an honor to serve. Wait! Where do you think you're going? I strayed from the path of righteousness, my lord. You speak of the day we all stood divided. Indeed. Had you not been there to unite us, Lord Serenoa, I shudder to think what our fate might have been. Yeah, I saw what you did, and I know you were pushed into a corner, Benedict, but that's in the past now, friend. Ever since then, I have been plagued by nightmares. Visions of Norzelia swallowed up in flames because of my foolish counsel. But Norzelia has emerged stronger, and we could not have safeguarded her without you. My plan callously ignored Lady Frederica's people, and would have driven King Roland away. I failed you, both as steward to House Wolfort and as a man. I have no right to be part of this realm's future. Stop right there, Benedict. Yeah, Benedict, really. Lila's done like five million worse things than you and she's doing fine. Believe me, you're welcome here. Who among us has not once erred? What is important is that we learn from our mistakes. If you haven't the strength to stand after you fall, you must learn to lean on others. That is how we came this far. Whenever one of us became lost, the others helped us find our path. Is that not the way of your beloved house, Wolfort? Lord Serenoa. Our work has just begun. We must stand together to forge the best path forward. We cannot hope to do this without you. Pray remain with us, Benedict. House Wolfort needs you. As do I. <sighs> I refuse. I refuse to abandon House Wolfort and its lord. My allegiance lies with you, Lord Serenoa, now and forever. I am heartened to hear this, my friend. I will not fail you, or this realm, my lord. Damn. 
What an incredibly heartwarming scene to see after the incredibly tragic scene of us having to fight Benedict. Now then, you are on your way to the Crown City, if I am not mistaken. Let us make haste, so as not to keep King Roland waiting. Ha, ah, yes. About that. You still waver as to whether or not to divulge to him the truth. <laughs> there is nothing I can hide from you, Benedict. I know I should keep the secret for House Wolfort's sake. And yet... Do as your heart tells you, my lord. The bond between the two of you will not fray now. Your words hearten me, Benedict. I now know what I must do. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta admit, people were right. Golden Route is really good. This doesn't do any of the pitfalls that I usually dislike about true endings. This is a good wrap-up of everything. Sarah Noah? Is everything all right? There is still time until the ceremony. There is something I must tell you, Roland. But of course, friend. What is it? I want you to see this. It was given to me by my lord father before he passed. A royal signet? But only those of the royal line are meant to have this. However, did Lord Simon come to possess it? My father told me on his deathbed that it was given to him by King Regna to be passed on to me. But that would mean... Indeed. My mother, the Lady Destra, came to House Wolfort bearing His Majesty's child. Then that makes us... Brothers? I am sorry, Roland. Perhaps I should have carried this secret to my grave, but... I simply could not. I do not expect you to simply take me at my word. Pray examine the ring for yourself. There is no need. I trust Lord Simone's words. You do? Do you recall that fateful day, Sarah Noah, when our diverging convictions threatened to tear us apart? I do. You, Frederica, and Benedict, you could not see eye to eye. I lost sight of my duty as king and thought bending the knee to Hyzant would save us. I feel ashamed of my cowardice to this very day. But you were different. You never gave up. You found a path we were all willing to walk together. I think that more than proof enough of your royal blood. But no. Being king is not just a matter of lineage. A king must hold fast to his ideals and be a beacon of hope to his people. His ears must be attuned to the wishes of all and his eyes must see all paths, even those not shown by the scales. Are you about to give up the throne? Sarah Noah, my brother, you are capable of that and much more. I have no doubt you were meant to rule this realm. Roland. I will give you the throne, if you so wish it, and swear to see your will done. Man, the people are going to be so confused. <laughs> I am flattered, but I must refuse. Your words now are proof enough of your kingship, Roland. The people are ever in your heart, and you have shown that you can look back and learn from your mistakes. Marcellian needs a king like you at his helm. I am Sarah Noah, son of Simon and Lord of House Wolfort, ever a faithful vassal to his majesty, and his closest friend. I just could not go on living without telling you the truth. Hmm. Your Majesty, everyone has arrived. Thank you, Huet. Let us begin the ceremony. Yeah, we're wrapping everything up. Where's my talk with Frederica? Yes. Here we go. Thank you, everyone, for coming here today. 
The war is over, and we have reached an agreement on the salt crystals. They will be deemed property of the Norzellian people as a whole, and be distributed fairly across the land. Lord Swarog and Minister Lila, we cannot thank you enough for your help in this endeavor. Think nothing of it, King Roland, but know that this is just the beginning of a new age. Indeed. And in this new age, I hope that all of Norzelia can overcome the borders of our nations and join together as one. In order to do so, Lenbrook wishes for an equal and peaceful union with Estrost and Heising. And the first steps toward that are self-governing territories, yes? Correct. I will allow for free trade of goods, salt crystals included, between these territories. I will gradually ease the borders, while fostering awareness of a unified Norzellian people. I would like Lord Svarog to preside over the new Esfrosti territory. Of course, King Roland. I will do all I can to achieve my son's vision. Minister Lila, I would like you to preside over the Hyzantian territory. Gladly, King Roland. And presiding over both Wolfort and the Rosellen territory. I would have none other than my dearest friend and companion, Sarah Noah Wolfort. You command, Your Majesty. And I do believe that concludes the formalities. I have but one more order for you, Sarah Noah. Ask and it shall be done. If you insist. I order you and Lady Frederica to have your long overdue wedding at the soonest opportunity. Yeah, that's what I was waiting for. When he said ceremony, that's what I thought we were going for, but here we go. What? Roland, there are still so many matters to attend to. We couldn't possibly. This is an order from your sworn liege. You dare not refuse, Lord Wolfort. Roland. <laughs> what better to mark the start of an era of unity than a wedding? You will be my nephew in no time, Lord Serenoa. God, it's so ha it's so adorable seeing how fucking happy Svalrog is. He he isn't like brooding or anything anymore. He's he's just genuinely happy. It's adorable. I love it. His voice has totally changed. I know it is sudden, but shall we, Frederica? I would like nothing more. Oh, strap in everyone. We're not done yet. This epilogue is going. I said I was going to finish and damn it I am. This still isn't the longest video I've ever made. I never expected to see all these familiar faces here. It is a true testament to the path they walk together. Yeah, I saw Jerome, I see Asabara, uh, I see Yens down there, where the text box is covering him up in the bottom right. Indeed, this is not only a celebration for Glenbrook and the Roselle, but Esfrost and Hyzant as well. Their union will become a symbol of the new era. A new dawn is breaking over Norzelia, and I am honored to be here to see it. The young lord's all grown up now. Feels like it was just yesterday when he was no higher than my knee. Oh, Erador, I fucking love you. I feel the same about Frederica. She was always alone, yet today she is someone's bride. This is the happiest day of my life. Oh, this is too fucking wholesome. Oh my god. I'm gonna go into, like, cardiac arrest over this. My friends, it would appear the young couple is ready to begin. This is especially weird as someone that's had their wedding Without within, like... Ado, let us commence the ceremony. Within the past year. Please welcome the bride and groom, Frederica Esfrost 
I'm Sarah Noah Wolfort. Let's see the dress. I want to see what Sarah Noah's wearing too. Tux Sarah Noah? Do they even have tuxes here? <laughs> I don't know. What? You're not even gonna show us the picture? It might be at the end of the credits. It might be at the end of the credits. Oh boy. I mean, we've seen these credits before, but... Oh my god, what a fantastic game. This was basically... everything I wanted it to be. Exactly to a T. It was so much fun. The story was... It started off slow and then just got so much faster and became really, really good. They had a bit of setup to do. I think the different paths and the endings are very, very cool. Uh, you don't really see that much effort put into that stuff anymore when it comes to multiple endings and, like, choices matter and stuff like that, so... That was really refreshing, refreshing to see. I just love strategy RPGs. I don't claim to be good at them, but damn it, do I love them. So... God, this was just such a fantastic adventure. It was so, so cool to play. I got really attached to the characters. If I had to say who my favorite characters were now... Um, I would still say Eridor is probably still one of my favorite units to use in battle, and one of my favorite characters personality-wise. Um, I would also say that Huet is probably one of my favorite characters to use in battle, and I also like her character. Um, Milo is very cool, both character and in battle. Um, I just, I don't know, I was attached to so many of them. You know, there were some weird ones like Yulio, who I didn't get to spend a lot of time with, and Picoletta, who quite frankly, even after I upgraded her a lot, still seems pretty useless, except for the decoy ability. But, all in all, this was a fantastic game. It was so good, and I would love to see a sequel or something at some point. Maybe, like, you know, there it, there are more countries or other civilizations in the world, and the unified Norzelia has to stand against them, um, or something like that. Or, um, I forget the name of the people that make these games. It's the Octopath Bravely Default developers, I believe. Or they can just keep doing their own thing and just keep making weird stuff like this. I would totally be down for that. I would love a return to strategy um, RPGs. You know, like bring back Tactics Ogre, bring back Final Fantasy Tactics, make more of these. I don't care. I just want more of it. I love this. I live for it. It is amazing. And I also live for JRPGs. But... <sighs> This is a long video, so I should probably try to keep it short. I've already given a lot of my thoughts before, but I really did just have such a such a fantastic time with this, and people were definitely, definitely right about the Golden Route. It wraps things up very well. It wraps things up in a way that makes sense. I definitely think I would have lost something um, had I not done the Golden Route, which, you know, in other games, like, I mean, I'm not meaning to make fun of Shin Megami Tensei V, but while the true ending was cool, um, the amount of work it required and what the payoff you get at the end I don't feel like was substantial enough for the work. This feels substantial as hell. We get different battles, different like boss fights, different context for our characters. We get our characters' reactions basically to like the other path that you took and you get to see like oh this is if things go b like really really bad and this is if things go well um like it what's what's the word i'm looking for in like most true endings that i don't like you just get a special new cutscene, and it doesn't really do much this completely changed the scale of the entire game like you got new cutscenes, character relationships ended in different ways different things happened it's amazing, and I really, really like that. I think that's one of the biggest strengths of this game, hands down. It was amazing for that reason, and I gotta give them props for that, because there isn't something I've played in a while, especially not a JRPG, um, that places that much of an emphasis on decisions. Uh, there's really not very many things I can say that I didn't like about it. Um, I w I, it would be nice if you could like see your convictions on a first playthrough, like your stats and like where you're leaning and stuff, that would be cool. I don't think that's something that needs to be limited to, um... Wow, that's, that's Yenz's ultimate ability is building a ballista? Interesting. Um... I, I don't think it's something that... it's... I don't think it's something that needed to be limited to a New Game Plus playthrough. I see why they did it, 
because they want to encourage people to do all of the different paths and stuff. But it would have been nice to be able to see those things, um, you know, on the first playthrough, just to kind of get an idea of where you're sitting and how the convictions work, because for most of the time when I was making decisions, I was just going with whatever, you know, struck my fancy. I wasn't trying to build any particular way because I didn't understand how it worked and I couldn't see a meter. So that stuff was kind of behind the curtain. Of course, on a New Game Plus playthrough, I've been sitting here so long the Switch went to sleep. Um, on a New Game Plus playthrough, a lot of that would make a lot more sense. But yeah, there's really not enough good I can say about this. Um, does it top like Final Fantasy Tactics for me? No, probably just because I have, frankly, a stupid amount of nostalgia for that game and I absolutely love all of its story and all of its characters. But this is probably the closest something's gotten in quite a while, especially as far as strategy JRPGs are concerned. Um, I don't think anything else has really scratched the itch this well, and I'm happy that it scratched it that well. And I'm happy that people that are a fan of the genre can finally get something like this to bite into for a while, so... I think that's probably all I have to say. Let's see if we got an extra cutscene, maybe some art. There we go. Look at that. Look at all of them. We got Yens, we got Lila. Who's that with Lila? Like, Kid Lila? Roland, Cordelia, Gila. Um, there's Eridor, Jerome, Hasabara, Claris looking evil as fuck still. Svalrog crying. <laughs> Svalrog crying. Uh, holy shit, Anna is really short. Or Benedict is a giant. Yeah, no, no, Anna's just really, really short. Look at that. Even next to Milo. Maybe Anna was younger than I thought she was? I don't know, I kind of assumed she was, you know, older. Like, 20s, 30s, like, kind of a lot of other people. But yeah, maybe she was just younger. Archibald is apparently incredibly tiny, probably because you're old man. Or you're, like, crouching down or something. Yeah, I can't, like, look at Claris. Look at that face. That is the, that, he is the villain of the next game. Why did they make Claris so evil looking? He didn't do anything wrong. He was in it just because, just for the money, basically. But he didn't do anything wrong. Look at him, though. Looks like a Disney villain. <sighs> all right all right so with that and this three hour and 40 minute video that i hope i can actually get up tomorrow i think we're gonna go ahead and end things off here um if you for some reason enjoy watching enjoyed watching me play this and want to see anything else from me I do have a list of uh, all of the JRPGs and uh, various other games and other genres that I've completed on my channel. Um, but if you've made it to this point, I really thank you. It was a fun adventure to share with everyone, and it was so exciting reading a lot of the comments and everything. Uh, comments and everything. So thank you for that. This was a fun adventure. Definitely one of my favorites that I've done. So yeah, we already know about New Game Plus. Save our clear data. We'll go ahead and put it, uh, right after Calm Waters. There we go. The hawk that flies free. Hawk flies free. Let's go back to the main menu just in case it tells me or gives me anything else for getting the golden route. We'll just check. Ooh, new title screen. Yeah, look at that badass art. New song, too. Ah, uh, all right. We got vocals for the theme. I was wondering if they were going to do it. I was wondering. I think there's no better place to end this LP off here, letting this song lead me out. So 
Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for something new.